big, the big top 16 event, even though to us, like a dojo, right? It's not the most major as far as points go or anything like that. Uh, but as far as, you know, class of play, some of the best players were there. And I've already seen a bit of the brackets. I was spoiled on some of it, but there's even some surprises. So don't spoil it. If you watched it already, you know what happened yesterday because I'm sure some people stayed up late or watched the archive. But if you haven't seen it yet, this is new to you. Then you know what to do. You know, enjoy the ride. And this is, for me, my real reaction too because I haven't seen any of this happen. I just know some results and I don't even know all the results. All right. Anyway, let's get it. I'm almost set. Where's my, my camera set up? So uh, keep in mind that this is we're watching it from our archive, and we're not. I'm not necessarily sure how amazing the audio was on this. So the audio might be spotty in some spots and that type of thing. But you know, let's appreciate that they, they try to put on a good show, and you know, let's try to overlook it if there's anything that's weird or, or funny in the archive. You know how it is. All right, let's go. I don't know how loud this needs to be. I just know, okay, so 7 minutes, 12 minutes. I'm not sure what the first match is. I just know that it's starting up around here. Oh, for the it's going to start with the top. Oh, there we go. Started with the first match. There it is. Undoubtedly right now ready Wait, for the was there a match before that? Game, I don't want to miss any games. Let's just make sure. Okay, there we go. Oh, nice. They showed the bracket. That's so sick. That's so perfect. I'm going to try to screenshot this or something if I can. Just so I have it. Filled country with Can I have that back? Players that you just that little have to see the belief. That was like perfect. That was exactly right. Oh, I don't doubt. I'm going to try to. And, oh, there and, it is. Nice. Okay, so this is the bracket. Perfect. This is exactly right. I'm going to screenshot this and just put it in something. That way I have it and I can tell you which players. What I was spoiling you, this is actually really sick. This is exactly what we need. So let me just load this up. So we got Farzine versus Ali. We got Mugao versus S S Harib. I don't know a lot of these cats. Extinguisher versus Numan. We got the John. That guy used to be a top Marduk player, but he's he's just good in general. Versus Hamad Bryan. Uh, probably playing Bryan. You heard the name. Awias is there. Awias Honey. Arsene Ash versus Kasim Mir. That's freaking crazy. Uh, Zubair uh, versus some wreck. They, this is all the nutty, okay? There's some really good matches here. Arsene went to lose his bracket, fighting in the mirror match against another Azucena player. I almost wanted to say Katarina for some reason, which makes no sense. But he lost to another Azucena player. But then they had to have a run back and lose his bracket, and he won the run back. So for anybody that's going to ask, why is Arsene the loser's bracket? That's why. And I know 20 people are going to ask in the stream, why is Arsene the loser's bracket? But just tell them the answer when they ask, all right? Me, Lohai, Yuyu, Joka. Arsalan Ash. Yeah, Berserk, this is this is not live. This has happened yesterday, but if you haven't seen it, then it's new to you, and it's new to me because I haven't seen it. So I'm watching this. This shit happened at like 5 in the morning, and I didn't feel like getting up at 5 in the morning on Sunday. I value my rest on my Sunday, okay? So we're going to watch this on a Monday. First match right now, actually. We're not wasting any time whatsoever. This is going to be crazy. DWG points on the line today. The spot on the boss gauntlet on the line today. And we're starting heavy, my friends. We are starting insane. Ah, okay, so I see. So it's it's not him. just a wise so honey. That's a that's a different a wise. Right Potentially. That's crazy. Are done. Man, I'm so excited for this oh, one. Oh yeah, we're starting off with a oh, pretty strong match in the first, first game first game Let me try of the day. Let's Brian try to find the right the volume and level. I think it's around Brian. here. I might, depending so on the audio, I might end up just playing some of my own music and just listening so to it depending on how stable or unstable it is. It seems not bad here. So Hamad Bryan versus the John. This is the winner's bracket. They're starting with the winners, then they're going to go into the losers. And uh, I'll just recap. To anybody that's jumping in, there's maybe there's like one guy that cared about Master Duel that's jumping in. This is for Tekken. I'll recap some of the new stuff that's going on in Tekken 8. So this game got a whole new heat system. And it, it, that means that there's heat burst, which is kind of like soul charge if you ever played the new soul caliber. You got uh, heat engagers, which are buttons you do that just put you into the heat mode automatically. And then when you're in the heat mode, you have heat dash, which lets you get like a free mix up. Or a free combo, and what then you have grab? heat smash, which is just the same thing as rage drive really from Tekken is. 7. He is pressuring John but you can only do it in heat now, rage. you can't John just do it in rage. Activate. There's also still rage drives that's still in the game. What up, Josh? Oh, Bam, your neck Very is done. Nice. All right. Could be anyone's game at this point in the alley. Man, honestly, they put Soul Calibur in this game. I'm sorry to tell you. 
That's the, the God's honest the truth. They put Soul Calibur in Tekken. So I don't know if we're getting another Soul Calibur for a while. I'm not saying we won't get one eventually when there's enough outcry. People say, hey, man, it's been 20 years. We're Soul Calibur. But, you know, that Soul Calibur is not going to be the Soul Calibur like you remember when you were a teenager. And by then, your hands might, your hands might be too old and too slow to enjoy it anyway. So you know what? You might have to try Tekken. I'm sorry. Sorry to tell you. So that's something that you definitely want to use. Oh, yeah. Blocked that. Very nice. Both guys are in heat. So you gotta be watching out. Brian. Yeah, what's good, Nerd Josh? What's good, Tenor Clubs? What's good, everyone? Let's enjoy some good high-level matches and learn some stuff and see what type of characters we can see. Uh, one big thing about this game in general is that it encourages the high level of aggression, all right? Get in their face. You have really good armor moves that are strong. Uh, hit confirms. Some, some hit confirm moves are very powerful. Uh, that type of thing. And uh, each character, there's a lot of characters that got some new plus frame type of get in there move. Like Brian got that new, you just saw it, Dakota. So go back one, bam, get in there when I feel like it. This is plus frames. A lot of other characters have some move like that now. Activates right off the bat. Throws are also really good too, so King is powerful. Throws B armor. Oh, the burst! Did you see that? The smash. Word blasted. You don't don't spoil the results. You know what it is. Okay, this could be a good. I haven't seen either, so I want I want to know what's up and who gets the furthest. But I'm hyped now. Now that you mentioned John Kazama, she's one of my favorites. John actually has the answer to it. Lost a lot of life. He could kill actually. I think tornado, right? Oh, that was worth it. That life loss was worth it. Maybe not. Okay, no, it doesn't matter. Goes, Still got it. Low, that was sick. Not gonna come out. He's not going to be able to deal with that. Ladies and gentlemen, watch your toes. At first, I was thinking to myself, man, you know, the John, what's he going to do? There's no Mardak in this game. And then now I see him on King, and I'm like, never mind. He don't have anything to worry about. This character's great. Great. Like fucking Tony the Tiger. All right. Trade in the favor of, uh, I don't even know who. The John does seem like uh, he is at a bit of a life deficit. But that's something that he can't take away. Yeah, these add Even though it's a high, it's so fast. These lows, these sneaky shots, you know, some highs, you're just like, okay, they're going for their high plus frame thing. I'm just going to crouch now. No, that thing, Beautiful work he just Brian instantly tries to draw punch you. Once more. Could have done more with the wall, I think. Still safe. He's doing a lot of check dog. Nice. He's, he's looking for that. That's exactly what he was looking for. That's why he was doing all those dogs. He had in his mind what was coming, and he was right. It was coming. trying to get us hyped. Already it's a dance back and forth. Look at this. Try okay. to get the chain going. Will it go for the ground? He, maybe he can get the wall? Almost. Right, close enough. Close, to the close enough that he can miss. Nice. That's a punish. Oh, no. He tried to be funny with the cancel. Disaster strikes and Hamad Brian. Gonna He's feel in the so much trouble. That. Almost oh, dead. Oh. Okay, he does have a lot yeah, of... He's shook. He doesn't know what to... Oh, sick punish. He's alive. Never mind. And he starts heat. He can get a heat dash mix up after the combo's over. Still in heat. Oh, he read it. He read it. Oh, he read his idea. No. Yeah. Oh, yep. no. He read, Stepping for the he read it completely exactly what he was going to do. Man, these guys are too good, chat. You got to understand, as me as someone that's been playing Tekken for a long time, I can look at the situations I recognize, okay, this guy's going to go for this because he has to. But then sometimes when you're the one playing, you know, your hands are shaking. It's like a close match. So you're not always thinking about all those things. You're thinking about all the little things that have been happening as the match goes across. So for someone, thank you so much for the sub. For someone to that quick, just know, oh, I know exactly what they're going to do. And just immediately start sidewalking because they know a heat smash is coming. It's just, it's you just locking them out of the game. That's too good. So this will have a hard wall and a floor break. We asked a lot of people yesterday, who do you think the favorites are? A lot of people picked the John. That's Omega Smart stuff. Ha, <laughs> the Cesaro swing. <laughs> of course, man, John is a favorite. Doing These WWE lovers over here. I was the one, I actually voted for the John. Mm, your turn. For, uh, for our boss God. I wonder why Kings like that, that, that power crush thing so much. The Haro, they just like the growl. I'm sure it's pretty good when they do do a mid, but you know, kind of sometimes they do it and then you see it, and once you do it, you kind of gave away the plan. All right, you're going to go for this, right? So. And that close line from hell just looks like. You know, either they back off or they do something that's going to fuck you up for doing a power crush. They do it low. If they have heat, they'll like heat smash you. Looks like Hamad Brian wants to be able to keep control of this game right now. Hey, yo, he got it to work. Fuck all that stuff Spooky's saying. He got it to work. Boom. Taste this combo. He's a Kafka's life for that. He can come back from this. Fuck what Spooky's saying. Right <laughs> that was sick. Pressure the John, but that is a tall ask. Tall ask indeed. Because the John, he likes to be able to Wow, that's a sick smoke combo. Six step. What? Side 
Damn. I'm so sorry, Brian Players. I'm so sorry, Brian Players. I, I feel for y'all right now. That was that was terrible. What in the world was that? A lumbar check into the power bomb pro wrestling clinic here by the John. All right, <laughs> All right, yeah, that was that was that was wrong. I feel bad now. Now you know in his mind he's thinking about. It. He's like, what the game let me down? And in the second you lose that focus for a moment, there you go. Taste this combo. That was some BS before. Get spun. Still has the Snake Eyes buff. Mm -hmm. Just go for the legs. There you go. Mm. Now, activate now what? To be able to yeah, get heat smash him. If he wants to, he, he wants to growl like a dummy. Give him a heat smash. Garp. Oh, even better. Straight into the wall. Very good. He tried to get away from it. He didn't want to deal with it. Brian, Brian did, did you right now being pat and trashed. That was that was a terrible. I can do nothing but apologize for Brian at that moment. Not gonna be doing him any favors. Nice work. That's the okay, new good move. Two piece. Oh, so that's guaranteed. Nice. What? He was in the air. How that not? Nope. Where's the Brian? Can't get nothing. That's crazy. That was supposed to be a guaranteed combo. Well, you know what? Give me my round back. That was BS. What's wrong with King's Hopney? How come it don't be getting punished properly by Heapers? Because either he wins this and takes it to a next match, or he goes down to losers. That's just the level of competition here, isn't it? I'm sorry, that was crazy. How did that? How did that not for real splat him airborne and get a combo? That didn't make any sense. Oh, another shining wizard counter. Mods had those shining wizards. Check. I wonder if that's a thing with just his hop. Like it's just good for those. Oh, mm, big baby, Hulkamania. Yeah. doesn't work for me, brother. <laughs> oh, look at that. Dak. He tried to armor again, maybe. Something like that. Oh, look at that. Nice. Caught the hop. Come on, baby. No. That was your chance. He had it. No. Because they make Brian's best stuff some stupid one frame bullshit. Now you got to deal with it. You got to deal with it. You dropped your one frame input? Too bad. Deal with King. Nice low parry. Let's go, baby. Come on, clutch. Clutch. Rage art. Come on, please kill. That would be so incredibly clutch, especially after that happened. It might. I don't know. I'm worried. I'm scared. It did not kill. That's what that feeling was where I was so scared. It was that it didn't kill. Toot the hole. That was so close. Holy shit. That was a low parry? That was, I mean, that was he, he Ooh, man, the game, the game, the game was trying to make man, him lose. Yeah, I mean, when when you go, you need, when King goes into his rage, uh, his heat, pardon me, it's either high or low. You have to make that battle. prediction, right? Not only did he predict, right? He also had the timing. In the I mean, it does a mid there that he could do. It's not only high or low. A Jaguar run obviously tricks up a lot of people because you have he he's too, have he's too busy thinking about low high the the career player low high high low he got mids there bro he got good mids he got the elbow that walks past you and kills you right now we have one to one and John now starting to wail on Hamad Brian you know getting key charged in reverse man that's got to make him laugh hey he didn't want that that was maybe Kota took a back one maybe. Good stuff. Activates heater at the right moment. Just to stop him from coming in. He's trying to get out of it. Oh, dead. Dead. It's hit confirmable too, so he can just let it go, huh? That's pretty nice. That's one of the few things he got that's nice is that little wall splat BS. But then he didn't need... Oh, my God. He didn't necessarily need better wall, wall game at the high level because he always had the taunt, right? I guess the taunt's slow. It's good to have something else. It's good to have more options. Ahmad Brad still maintaining his composure. Wants to be able to get the perfect angle in and gets the nice counter round. hit throw. Very good stuff. Oh, nice He's stuff playing there. smart, but your turn. Your turn there. to bleed. John starting the string. Legal what's up, El Zocho? Also, what's up, Green Tea? How you doing? Damn. Activation in his face. All right. Uses the heat smash oh, and gets it. Hell yeah, the spooky ring. The wall. Yeah, so if you, you want to know what it looks like, Ozo Cho, it's, it's Chun Li. It looking like she's throwing like spooky dollars, basically. Oh, leg drop, brother. <laughs> <laughs> the old Hulkster tactics. Gotcha, yes. gotcha back. Right, go oh, I'm an idiot. It's old Bruce special. I'm not gonna think about it. Double knee coming out. No giant swings. Get your hands Cancels off. Out of that. Oh, nice. 
it beat the armor. Marky. It beat the armor. He was gonna come in. Mm -hmm. The only thing that will stop him is a smash. Oh my goodness, he's gonna get. He smash wouldn't have worked. Oh well, the only thing that would stop dude, King is a smash. Oh, RKO out of nowhere. And there we go. The John once again brings it down to match. RKO point out of nowhere. God damn. He's getting cooked. Count. If he wants to stay on the winner's side. Help this man. Oh, no. Help this man. He's getting decked. Left, right. He gets the wall there. Oh, that's nice. Spring kick. But, wow. The swipe track so good. Is his wild standing one an actual dedicated track move? It's hard to tell looking at the animation. Is that what that swipe is? Ow. He died instantly. King. The John said, pretty nice, bro, but watch this. That's what he told in the third game. Pretty nice game, too, bro. Watch what I can do. All right, well, that was the first. That, well, that was immediately hyped, the very first game. Here we go into match two. Oh, it looks like they're, they're going to be back-to-back -back bangers. Hell yeah. Extinguisher. And right now, Extinguisher is going to all hell and fire. Oh, it is, so it does, it, it is a dedicated home move. Okay. I shouldn't say dedicated. What's a word I should say? Like there's there's moves that home just because they're good at homing, but then there's moves that end the game. See, it has like that animation that tells you it's a, a, a like a, a dedicated like a tracking move. Everyone hates that move. Everyone knows. I need a better word than dedicated for that situation. But the activation goes for the Libertar stance. Because that's an important distinction. Some moves are good at tracking, but you can still stop them. And then some moves are, the, the game says, no, don't try to stop them. Already lost a lot of life. Got to watch out. He goes in for his heat dash, his own. Equalize. Take to the wall. Yes, Sick combo. Sir. Holy fuck. These guys are all ridiculous. That. That guy is a maestro. I know it's Numan, so we should expect him. Damn, dude. Oh, no. premature, though. Absolutely, yeah. and the, he is going to get punished for that heavily, and that will. What did he expect Azu Senna to do? Extinguisher. Man, Extinguisher is really impressive, huh? I just came out of nowhere. And this is why these dojos are so important. Oh, oh missed. It was off axis. He tried to do a sidestep or something. Is that what it was? Some auto sidestep move, maybe. He might have tried to do the the sidestep shoulder barge move thing that he has. And that's going to be beautiful. We'd love to be able to see more action. Maybe before they thought, you know, Tekken 7, they don't have a Kabla. chance. Tekken 8 has given them that confidence to be able to play. That's you good, because you take... Chance. If you block the first demo man that he does, you take a lot of confidence away from Paul with that. He's like, damn, he knew. Sick duck. He used to hit stop to crouch it. That's one way to deal with those high power crushes. Let's say you're getting in, and you're doing like what Numan's doing. He's doing his jab strings and his down four ones. If you do a down four one, you can do the same thing sometimes. You feel it hit. A power crush, and then you look, and if you see the high power crush, or you know it's a character that usually does a high power crush, like Victor always does back one plus two. Uh, Eddie, the new one, he has the back three plus four. Azucena, I think she does high power crush a lot too, right? If you're pretty sure it's a high power crush, you could just try to down back. Look at that health deficit. Versus if you block it, it'll be safe because since you hit the armor, it's gonna push by. There we go. It gets the, the extra push by. Blaze it to a T using those Tekken fundamentals of sidestepping. Yeah, no, the what he's doing is amazing. That's why you see me always impressed, bro. You know me. I play against good players, and when this, they do this stuff to me, even I'm impressed. And it's not like I don't be bringing my triple A to them. Even with Eddie, I'm already bringing some pretty hot stuff. But when I play against those best guys in tournament, they they can handle that shit. The guys on rank can't really handle it, but those best players, they can handle it. He's going to get it with the demo man. With the smash, no doubt. Oh, saving that to the favorites, baby. That was a good finish, all right. Unfaith. Yeah, we're just going to go to the... Oh, they didn't switch stage. This is the best part, is that we don't have to... Since we're not watching live, we can skip all that. Whenever someone makes a mistake like that, we can just be like, skip, no problem. All right, so this time, different stage, which is what they need. The Tekken World Tour official rules, you have to change stage every game. No matter, no excuses, no exceptions. You, you like this, you both like this stage too bad. No punish. I don't know why, what's Azucena's long range punish? What move does she do? I know she has something. Well, still has a tornado. Oh, you can just do the, her best combo, never mind. Yep. And right now, problems having he is, and there's the second wall break. Unfortunately, a little too far to be able to finish that combo. Yeah, I hate I hate the the hair. He's gonna make use of this juggle at Two, the Karen hair. I definitely, if I picked Paul, I would 100 percent not use this outfit. Oh damn! Holy fuck! She's ugh. I love when they do that animation, the the back spasms animation. You just hit them so hard. They just start twisting. 
I just love it. It's my favorite thing to do. No, everyone does, man. Like it's the death fist. That's what Paul's known for, yeah, man. Exactly. Oh, oh look at that. he murdered <laughs> that. And you know what? No one is sick of it. No one is sick of it. That is his patent move, and everyone loves it. Exactly. Oh, look at that. Extinguisher gets a round back. Beautiful stuff here. All right, Extinguisher wants to stay in this game, and he knows that. He Why am I cosplaying as Belmo from Scooby Doo? I don't know, man. I just like the shirt. All right, leave me alone. Next, someone's gonna tell me that I look like that that one guy that does the uh, the, the, the the he reviews the stuff that's fake or whatever. I forget his name. That's the next thing that someone's gonna say. I'm already on to y'all. All right, y'all make the same jokes over and over. John K, you gotta come out with new material now. <laughs> <laughs> has been and has brought him up to match point now one more round and he is advancing into top eight extinguisher gotta pick up the pace i do too this is comfortable i don't care if people make jokes that i look like boma for sure no man children not giving him any purchase beautiful timing i used to love scooby-doo as a kid i don't care about that new boma like weird show shit new man 2-0 that was a beast Sidesteps it. Now I'm trying to remember the guy's name. It's just some guy that he does. He does like YouTube uh, clips, and the clips it'll be him testing some product online that's fake, or some you know some video theory that's fake, and then he'll he'll pretend like he'll play it like first like it's real, but then at the end he'll show you what the gimmick is or that it's actually fake. I don't know if he's gonna resort to it. I don't know. I don't live there anymore. I moved to the West Coast, but New York is just crazy, bro. The world is crazy. Kuma with the fish smacks you in the face. No, I don't I don't wear the skirt. The I'm sure wearing a skirt is comfortable, Kuma. especially around the house. Alyssa you ain't got nothing else to do. You wear a skirt. Woo! Nobody could see you anyway, but no, I don't do that. But it's making That's not it work how I now. I mean they've made it so good. The legacy. Alyssa, she wears skirts. Alyssa, I don't know. Like, S Hari versus Asad Asad Mugal. I'm not really familiar with either player that much. This is the best part about this, that we get to see the Pakistan guys that they can't even get a visa to travel. Hell, Arsenal can't even get a visa to fucking evil Japan. These guys can't get a visa to go nowhere. So we get to see what they can really do in their home turf. Someplace familiar to them. Oh, you gotta be careful with this bear, man. You don't know where he's gonna hit from. Look at that. Also, Mughal actually bringing it back with the heat smash coming out now. The Cosby kids. I know what you're talking about. You gotta watch out the wild standing. Four. Gives it to Aslan Mughal in the first round. Man, all my heroes. We still got Mike Tyson, guys. We still got Mike Tyson. Some of my other childhood heroes, they did some, some skeptical stuff. Yeah, that's a lot of life done, but right now Kuma's got the launch on him. And he will be getting that white life back. A bit of it. Tyson, you, you know what he's doing, all right? You know where he's coming from. You, he told you from the beginning. The activation. Oh, and he's, he's a straight shooter. He tells you, I'm gonna, you know, Alyssa, eat your heart. Size. Good stuff there by Ashari. Eat your kids or whatever crazy stuff he was saying that one interview. These guys have nice convert. Their wings, man. They're cool as hell. They don't get. Hey, Tyson, bro, if you look at the training montages, if Logan, if, if, if Paul, and it's not even Logan Paul, it's the other Paul, right? Whatever else his name is. If Tyson loses that fight, I, you might not see me anymore, chat. For real. I'm not going to insinuate what might happen. I'm just saying that that's it. You one day y'all will go online and be like, man, Spooky hasn't been online for like three months. What happened? It'll be me watching that fight and having seen Tyson lose. I just will be done with the world after that. Strong and steady with the Alyssa. One of these guys is making it to the top I don't even have any money on her or anything. I just, I just, come on, man. Tyson can't lose to that guy, please. No way. Interesting stuff. Isharb started uh, with dropping around, but then immediately after, just no problems. I know he's old and all that, but Foreman got the title. How old was Foreman when Foreman got the title? You need to sort of like download your opponent, and that sometimes he fucking knocked his ass out at one punch. He had the other guy man the post interview because George Foreman was like, "Yeah, I was setting up for that one punch." The other guy was like, "Man, you got lucky." Don't tell everybody you just setting up for one point. You just got lucky. Who is that well, I'm that shit was sure fun. Favors Alyssa, because she doesn't really necessarily. Is this button check? Or are they going? Are they going in? All right. Just fine without it. But then again, Bear Tom with the hunting stance is also really, really strong over here. Oh look at that! Headbutt. Smash, go for the head, but the patented Mishima head, but sir, Mishima's have hard heads. Okay. Chainsaws out. One low, blocks the heat. Activation. 
That goes for the heat smash. Will be capitalizing on that whip. Hop kick. And Usul Mogul gets the first I'm, round. I don't know, man. I'm fine with the Bears. The Bears have been kind of a part of the game since, like, the jump. I feel like when people complain about the Bears, it's always guys that don't. I, I like when Tekken has a million different characters. Those, that's the same reason. Saying stuff like the Bears are boring is the same reason why you don't have, like, Alex and Roger Jr. around. Because people will say stuff like that. Oh, I don't want to play the stupid animal character. I want to play, you know, Jin, Jin Kazama. It's like, come on, man. Just let people rock. It's hard to do with this level. It is a pretty huge stage. One day you load right. that shit up and the character roster yeah, will be like Marvel Infinite. And tree. part of the problem will be complaining about stuff like Bears being in the game. Oh, wow. Gotta watch out. Oh, there we go. He just goes for quick and easy stuff. Chops him down a size once more. Yeah. No need to mix up. And he continues that string. Yeah, I don't know about Gone. That might be stretching no it, but, there. you know, we but could have Alex or Roger, oh, maybe, you know. Cool like, what's wrong with that? He still has his heat. He's, oh, missed there. God might, might be stretching right, just a little bit. <laughs> no worries, that against oh. He looks so funny. Even even Dr. So B, like, stuff. I'm not going to yeah, go as far. Like, I like Dr. B. I think he's cool. But, I, you know, like in Tekken Tag 2, where they wanted to put in 500,000 characters, it made sense for him to be in the game. I think if they put Dr. B in as a character in this game, I'd be I'd be a little... Like, come on, man. Good stuff. Fishes out a hit. And I'm not even trying to get key characters. I'm just saying, let's 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 stick to characters that are meant to be played at least. A dive kick coming out, and that's one hit, and there it is. The arm rocket comes out, and now match point. Yeah, with Bears, you know, I, I kind of feel that and that with the Bears. I don't know if they consider it that way, though. Like, it seems like people have, like, the, like a mentality that the, they use the Bears to cheat and say, we have this many characters, but really it's just, like, two characters copied and then, like, one move is different or something. Which, do not wrong, they for real only have, like, I don't even know how many moves are different between the four moves or something. Most of the move list is the same. See, oh, there we but go. Beautiful work. The same time, I think they plan it that way. They're just like, okay, because we're making Kuma, well, fuck it. We're just going to throw Panda in there. I don't think they think of it like because we put Panda in the game, we're not putting in this other character. That'll come back to him. It's remote control. Yep. That was a great round. Yeah, One piece I've, now. Absolutely. I think they got other problems. Like, I, I normally don't care about DLC stuff, right? But one that, you know, you never expect to be able to him the, the new him. outfits and things like that not being in the season pass, that was weird to me. That just seemed strange. And then I looked in the list and looked at the items in the, that are in there, and I was like, wait, so all the cool items are locked behind. I have to just give them more money? I disagree. I think cool. they made Kuma particularly. And I appreciate them. They support me. They yeah, bring me on the tour. Yeah, they flew me everywhere last okay. year. So I appreciate them. Thank you, Ben, and I go for everything you've done for me. But why Why is it $100 or whatever for for the characters plus the game, and then you got to spend more money just to get the extra cosmetics and whatnot? That's crazy. This shit better be funding Tekken 9, 10, 11, 12, and 13. And give her the big bear uh, booty. As well as every tech and world tour. What's respectable rank to get? Whatever rank you can get, Astro. Or Astro. Rank doesn't mean anything. What rank are you? Don't be embarrassed to tell me. Tell me. Don't don't, don't inflate your rank. Don't add three dance to your rank or whatever. What's your actual rank? Don't be afraid to tell me. And I'll tell you what I think. That's true. be used to his moves, but Sharp doing well to kind of get back into it. That is true. You know, like definitely a lot of people here don't want to be able to deal with the big bodies. And, you know, they don't generally have that practice. But, man. Also, it's different to different people. Guy. You just got to Mike. That's pretty good. That's not bad. Watch out for him. But again, uh, people don't practice against the list. If you made to that well, rank, this is my opinion of general people oh, of that oh, rank. Oh, as someone that's ranked above you. My opinion generally of people around that rank is you guys know your character and you probably don't know like your combos and most of your hit confirms and you probably oh, got no. even like a ten, top 10 move list that you use, right? But usually there's some type of weakness you got that shows up if I play in a longer set against you. So maybe you're not good at breaking throws and you got to work on that. Maybe uh, you don't recognize frame data, so your punishment is bad, and that means I can get away with unsafe moves on you. Or you don't know times when you can duck on my safe moves, like that's an example. Uh, you know, things like that. So what will happen is eventually that weakness will show up, and if you show up those weaknesses, you will rank higher, and you'll get into those blue ranks, and you'll fuck people up in those ranks too. But you got to show up all that stuff. Oh, my God. Nice round so far, to say the least, for really, The down three secures the victory for him, and now we go down to the final round. They're going to let the transition play. 
Yeah, that too, like John Smith says, you can kind of dump the mole and then you can just come back into it or whatever. You doing better than me, John Smith. I don't got God on any of my characters. I'm having fun, a lot of fun playing Eddie in tournament though. Those God guys are hella good. Everybody that's got a rank uh, that I play against. Even when I once I start fighting against like the Tekken King, like that level of rank guy, I'm just like, yep, this guy knows all this shit. Can't get away with nothing. You gotta just get them legit and just outthink them. That's the only way to win. All right, a lot of white life stacking up for Koopa. most of the time. I'm sure that out. this plug puller is still in those ranks and things like that. But this way less once you get to that point. Most people that once you start getting to those ranks, a lot of the people that are there are just there because they, they grinded for it in whatever way they did it. Bear hunting season indeed, man. But what a game from us in Mogul, yeah, man. Yeah. Look, Kuma is one of those characters. Yeah, that's why I was saying with the ruler rank to break into those blue ranks, you got to be consistent because otherwise you can't outthink them, right? They're just going to punish all your stuff. And be like, haha, ha, this idiot likes to do high strings and they're just gonna duck and launch you or something like that. But then when you know how to mix it up, it helps a lot. It's not that you can't use those moves, it's just that you have to condition them with other moves and do certain things. And you kind of learn it as you watch the better play. That's one of the most fun things about this game. The more I watch better players, I learn some things and then I play for a week and then I watch them and then I learn some more things watching them. And it just, it's always, you always learn and play in this game. All right, so we're starting off strong. There we go for Zine. Capitalizes on that counter head. He's going to go places. Mm. Is it going to be an early wall bound? Yes, Damn. it is a wall bound. There we go. And there we go. Yeah, and that's. The, I missed that the, the most, man. That really helped away. me learn matchups. I really missed that. In Tekken 7, the way it worked was when you oh played someone goodness. online, you could rematch and you could just keep rematching what you wanted. Around. And there was even like a little unwritten rule. You didn't have to apply it all the time, but. That's crazy. There was an unwritten rule. If the two of you fought and y'all were the same rank, then the two of y'all had to fight either until somebody ranked up or somebody ranked down. That was just the agreement. It took 20 matches because y'all kept figuring each other out and the set went 50-50. Oh, well, then it took 20 matches. That's just how long it takes. I've had that shit happen. I've been in like, I've been in like, I don't know, Divine Ruler or something and just fought some other Divine Ruler that was kind of good. And then what? We, we're, we're playing for an hour and a half now. All the white life gone too. We're playing until some motherfucker finally gives up and then finally someone will rank up and then are cool. He doesn't know what uh, SNO is capable of. And there oh. we go! <laughs> Smash comes out straight away. This game, no, no, un unheard of. These guys can't even handle a two out of three. Oh, you gotta watch out because obviously. Two out of the one game, they're already out of there a lot of the time. Will have mix-ups coming out the wazoo. I bet it helps you like the first time you fight someone. It's really good in short set to have this mentality. You just better know what's going on before before it's too late. Down four will give it to him. But I have an appreciation for like learning characters in longer sets and like learning the matchup. Brazil will have to if he wants to be able to keep that keep that victory in his grasp. Yeah, they don't have that either. So you just have PC have guys with go. just their PCs all running out. You got oh, Wi-Fi guys all over the place. The there ain't no Wi-Fi test, so you just don't want, don't want that Wi-Fi, baby. Oh, is he working himself towards another perfect? It certainly don't looks worry, like the it. game's got rollback. Excellent. Rollback he fixes everything. Yeah. Another perfect. <laughs> Damn, these guys are too good. Brings it down to the final round. Immediate okay, break. these guys, these guys. He tried to catch him for doing the same trick. His crouches are really out. good too. I can't remember how bad his wall standing too is. I'm like, is, is this launch? He might be one of those characters that got launch wall standing too. And now a lot of lies lost. Sick combo. Bam. He can tornado and still get the ender. Smart. That was too good at the wall. Yes. Or see you in a bit, ten. The size of boulders on their shoulder right now. <laughs> These guys are out to prove. Sometimes I play them because I just want to get used to. You know, if you play in a tournament, and let's say I'm here in Cali and I gotta play somebody, and they're I don't know, they're in like Florida or something. You know, it's gonna be like hundred milliseconds or something probably, right? So I do. I play the Wi-Fi to get used to that scenario and feel what it's like to be underwater a little bit. But I don't usually enjoy it. Etch their names, you know, in history. As I just accept it because I'm like, all right, and, you know, this is there's what they so many y'all. Uh, and Based only so many guys. That's even head when head I see them, I'm like, oh, how nice are you? You bought me a wire. And that's what when I see the five bar, then then I'm like, I'll play you all you want. Don't matter what rank you are. You rank higher than me, you rank lower than me, I'll play you as many times as you want. Just bring me a nice connection. 
that's really opting to stay with the Shaheed. I Beautiful. think that is his main. Beautiful hop kick takes him straight to the wall. Big damage, not able to get that. No doubt, Chop Khan, how you doing today? I hope you guys had a good time. We wanted to watch it this weekend, but the hours were crazy. So this time I was like, you know what? I'm just I'm just gonna watch it during my hours. This is not the first time we watched you guys, Chop Khan. We watched you at the end of the the Tekken World Tour last season. You guys were doing some stuff before, some good events before Tekken 8 came out. We remember. Frazine brought SNLE into a lot of pressure because of the You were streaming a lot from, I don't know if that was Arson's house or if it was uh, somewhere else. You I remember to that too. Your opponent, you cannot let up for even a single second because if you do, you might find the chip stacked against you. And that is oh, it's nice. Hell yeah. Well, that's cool that you guys have. Is, is that like you guys have a Red Bull gaming spear now out there? Is that what's going on? That's crazy. That's pretty down. awesome. He, oh, he tried to get the optimal. You can do yeah, one two one tornado and just still get the forward the forward two two opening. series. But for some reason they hit wrong. That'll start coming out. Hey. Oh, nice. nice. Good block. Oh and it was splat. Man, no, he still got him. He still got him. That's crazy. That was that corner was deadly. How's the, the chairs have have them hook you up with some new chairs, bro. Please. I'm sorry, the street the street we were hurting looking at those chairs, man. That's the first thing y'all need is a chair sponsor. <laughs> Whoever can send y'all some. I know it's it's tough. Those chairs look like they've been through hell oh, chopped. That's what those chairs been through. Explosion. Which is absolutely nuts if you think about it. Sure, Chop Con. Here's what you can do. If you, oh, you mean for 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 uh for last night or whatever? Sure. Here's what you can do. If you want to see good stats from me, Chop Con, I can give you everything. Do, you might have me on Twitter already, but if you don't, what you do is DM me here, right? Just go to my Twitter, and then I will gladly send you today too if you want to see them or whatever, and if they want to see restream stats and that type of thing. And it's gonna help you guys get more shit. Then yes, I will happily give you all the stats. All right. So just go here right now. And I don't even think you have to, you might have to follow me first or send me a message, but if that's going to get y'all more shit and get Red Bull to give y'all more stuff, then happily, I will give you whatever you want. Just let me know. That was precision from Farzine. You Need I remind you, he actually got like three, two or three. Worst case, if you don't hear from me in a day or two and you see me on the stream again, come back and remind me. Be like, hey, Spooky, I need that stuff from you. Don't be afraid. Completely in his control. He had everything down to a T. Choice. Sweating. Be honest. Very very. One more game, guys. We continue just on YouTube. Our thing leave a cars final. Cool. So we're going on to the next one, chat. Remember, if you know what happened already, chat, don't spoil it. We're going to lose this bracket now. So now it gets extra crazy because you know everybody's gonna get knocked out of there. We'll go for the show you. And this is something that is probably gonna give him a lot of trouble because you know. Oh, I'm not talking about the ones these guys got. I'm talking about when you did the the pools. That's the question. I mean, that's a good We're just kidding around. Don't worry, bro. Don't pay us any mind. Oh my God! He, did, he needs to be paying mine. He need, don't pay me no mind. Watch out for that guy. Of course, everyone's that was sick. Everyone you know who's watching right now who hates Dragonov is gonna be you know like really really <laughs> rubbing their hands, yeah. like enjoying them. They're like, yeah, man, let's get him. <laughs> This guy cost me so much misery. And oh, so I someone mentioned this before in the chat. What's the meaning of of Elias again? Who's it has, and that's why you have a there's a, a meaning to it. That's like a cool meaning, and that's why a lot of people have that name. Blessed, something like that. Yeah, just no, just no biggie. You know, just go down in AOP, go down. Everything. I want to walk around and be like, yo, I'm blessed, spooky. That sounds cool. Got you blocked there. Good stuff, by a man. From him because it is so brutal. I don't know though. I, I don't really follow the rules, like so that might not work. Oh, sick punish. He still got something for it. That was pretty good. Down two. He didn't go for the low mix up. I would have low blocked afterwards and gotten hit by the mid. Unfortunately, got your back. Not able to take him to the balcony. Good block. It is off. Feeling the pressure mounting up against him as Dragonov and he. Smashes his way to victory. No, I think that's a different something else. Tries to go for the launcher, block. Locks the low. Sides. Wow, how how'd she get out of that? And she grabbed what the heck? Party's not over there. That grab is crazy. Look at the combo's guaranteed. The mix-up's guaranteed too. Yeah, she's pretty plus there. Again, he's dead. He's dead. 
That's too nasty. <laughs> there, awesome. there we are. It's not taking this to the final round. Not going out without a bang. What's up, Thunderline? How you doing? He knows how important this is, and he wants to be able to stay in the lead. Got OS. OS Lyaka trying to get in. He has the better character, but does he have the skills to be he able to He might have the better character, you? but not really. Xiaoyu's also freaking oh, stupid. This character's insane. Good dog. He could have made that even worse. And then you don't always know if you can check her with certain things. Like, especially highs. High, any any time that you press a high against Ling, Ling Xiaoyu, you better be really thinking about why you're pressing that high. Watch out, a lot of white health on his side. Even mids, you should be thinking about them sometimes, but especially highs. If you, hey. Even a job, you should really think about why you're pressing that job. <laughs> that is the first round for Irtha's Otherwise, Xiaoyu yeah, can happen to you. Takes it. Yeah. Over Dragunov Gaming. Bars. Yeah. yeah, we're going to need to uh, see this layout do a I, I always, I can't help but look at Yu-Yu's face in the background out of all the faces. Because everybody else looks angry or stern. Even Arsene's like, yeah, bring it at me, bro. But then Yu-Yu's the only one that has a smile. So I can't help but look at her. They forgot to change stage again. Tekken World Tour rules. You have to change stage every time. Also breaking the momentum. Let's go. But regardless, this stage is merciless. Walls are close. The lava gets going. Let's go. But man, what a look the stage has. I mean, like, the view is actually pretty nice. Who knew? Who knew? Out of space. He doesn't have a, a lot of variety in his oh, lows. Starting off strong. He has, like, down back force plus, right? And the then, w uh, an inch. he's got, like, the, what is it? The three. down forward three or whatever? No, down back three or whatever that low move. I think that one's minus. Uh, the sword swipe slow is zero, which is, that's pretty good. Zero is okay for a low. Damage, it's launch on block though. That's the part that's weird to me. It's like it's only zero when it hits, but then it's launch on block, which is like, like he did. He usually did. they do. Usually if it's a launch move, it's like plus or something, right? But whatever. That's that's just what they do. Uh, I don't know. His lows are not spectacular. But then he has the he, he idle low. That one's cool. I know people look for it all the time, but that helps. The fact that people look for it all the time helps the rest of the game. Because otherwise your mids would never work if they weren't always looking for that low. Keep on keeping on saying you can't no more. Little Chinese girl. Even I underestimated the gunshot before. I was like, this gunshot was stupid. Anybody good is just gonna crouch like an idiot. But then I found that it's it's it, it you got you, it's good to mix with running too. Cause then they they stand up because they're scared you're running too, and then you shoot them, and then they duck cause of gunshot, and then bam, you run, you punch them in the face for ducking. So I I, I have more respect for it now than I did before. Before oh, I was like, this move is trash. Why would you even do this in neutral? Straight in for the big Ooh. damage at the wall. Soccer kicks. I saw people doing it, and I was like, so you guys just want to get duck and launch, huh? No nice. break on the throw, and that is it. Nice knee bar to close out. Very nice. Oh, yes, Lyaka knows what. He's pretty. He, he, he makes me think of Noctis, to be honest. He might still be good in the end, just because his basic moves are good. Like, his basic jab is fine. His basic down for one is okay. That back one mid, the frame data is bad on, on block, but most characters can't really punish it or whatever, right? So, that, like, that's an okay mid. And so, because, like, his basic moves are okay, like, he still might turn out to be, like, a good character. In the end. I don't know if I can say for real that he's the bottom. But maybe 10 characters is a lot. Course, man. Maybe he really is bottom 10 just because 10 characters right. is a, a big and chunk of the lower roster. This is up one round away from eliminating OS Liakat on final round. And all these matches are so tight. Coming down to the wire again. Make or I'll, 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 I'll I'll honestly enjoy picking Eddie. It's not that I didn't enjoy playing Victor. He was pretty cool. And I, I love trying new characters out and learning how they all work. But he's he's hard to win with against somebody that understands completely how he works. That's the main thing that I'll say. Like, if they fully understand the character and they know all his options, then it's, it's hard to win against someone that knows how everything works. He's mashing. He's mashing. <laughs> you better get off that RP or you're in trouble. Bro, he doesn't know what's going on. Elias, you got to. Oh, no. Oh. Bro. <laughs> oh, that was so unfortunate. He actually pressed the special style. No. Came down to the last round. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Damn. See? No, no, no. Come on. You can't tell me that's a Herman Miller chair, bro. Look at that thing. That You need new Red Bull. Give these guys some new chairs. <laughs> that chair seen hell. <laughs>
it does not today. A man's knocked has bowed out of the tournament. That doesn't happen to a real Herman Miller, bro. Yeah, if they told you, if they told you that was a Herman Miller, they lied to you. Really, really bummed out by that. Because he wasn't aware of that. This real Herman Miller don't peel like that. The buttons were not working. Oh, poor guy. Poor guy. Oh, man, that's heartbreaking. Feel for him. Well, that's all right. I mean... I would like to if, if I mean I'm you know how it is I like to, to I, I'm not gonna go too big on the nerves or the boss or whatever you know one thing that was helping him too I hate to admit it is the the, the, the regular throw being uh hard to break that's one thing that was I'm not gonna go as far as like I was carrying him but it helped a lot to be able to just be like okay well I have you at the wall I'm gonna go for one plus three throw or oh, YouTube is looking for everything else you're not gonna break on time that was nice and I'm not saying that they should give him that back or anything like that because it was a little glitchy and weird that you couldn't break his throws right but give him something with throws that would be cool like some type of gimmick where he could have an install and then while he has install his throws are harder to break that would be nice that's a Armando Miller limited tickets available they're going out fast so check out ticket wallet to get your tickets for the boss gauntlet let's go no all stopping. Right. All right, next. LTG. Right I don't even understand why that guy gets so mad playing. I guess that's just his gimmick. Is that what his gimmick playing online? Sorry. Versus Claudio Serafino. He's okay when he, like he's he's on his, his when he's on his, his his game. He's okay. Like his victors are and his other characters. Like I said, he's okay too when he's on his game. But he don't. Yeah, and this is a match definitely gotta watch out for because it's an Ash boy gonna go up again. He don't really try to improve. He kind of just does the same stuff that works day one, and then it works from day one, and then once it gets to around day three, and that stuff stops working. He don't really add too, too much to his game. Nice start by Osama. I tried to. You see me when I'm when I was learning Eddie every day. I added something new. Today is new combos. Today is getting better at punishes. Today is new mix-ups. New tech traps, all that stuff. I'm always adding something to the game that I do add. And I'm not even that good, so imagine what these guys do every day. Imagine what every day they're adding something. You're not ready for that, then you're only ever going to be a certain level in Tekken. That's always how it's going to be. Well, you know, he needs uh, even this Tekken that I know is, is designed for scrubs. Or maybe who knows? Someone might actually have his number this time. Every new Tekken is designed to be scrubbier and scrubbier. It only started getting when easier. He gets going, he definitely gets going, and there we go. Yeah. Tag Team 2 was like the last oh, hard Tekken. Oh, 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 oh tries breaking that days. wall, but unfortunately, the game has not been patched yet. Tag 2 still had OTG pickups oh, that you can get a full combo. It had a hard throw breaks where you had to break the one throw and the two throw correctly. They had all that stuff. This is not pretty. He does have activation, and there we go for the heat. Look at this. There's way too much scaling, but the down three will give it to him. 3 nothing, Osama. Who would have predicted that? Who would have predicted that indeed? I mean, Hafez Vir. Seems like, you know, he needs to do some waking up. Yeah, M Freeze, to this tournament was yesterday. Things. That's correct. Okay, so here's the interesting thing about this whole thing right now. We're just so checking it out because I haven't seen the end. I want to know what happened. I think Arson plays soon, doesn't he? Arson should be in the, within the next couple matches, I believe. Uh, oh, that's old fighting, fighting fight Lenore. There's no bracket up for this because I don't want you guys to get spoiled on what happens. But this happened on, this is the channel. I'll give you the channel it happened on. It happened on this channel, Boss GG. One second. So if you want to watch it later, the whole archive, or if you want to watch it without me, just go here, okay? Boss. Underscore GG. Just go to this channel. And you can watch the entire thing later. Actually, rematch from Boz Fight Night. Was that a punish? Where we had, of course. Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. What did he just do? Full crouch. Looks like Osama Can I go back for a second? Sorry, I got distracted. Yep. All right, looks like Hafez the Veer. Six Sabaki. She can use that just like Asuka, huh? Seems like he's scared for some reason. This is shouldn't be. This is actually rematch it is a punish. from Boz okay. Fight Night. Where we had Man, that's that's so good. You don't even have to know what low it is. You block any load that's not minus fourteen. You just do that move. That's so convenient. That must feel great as a gun player. Minus fourteen, then go for the the, the hop kick or the the while standing three. Excuse me. It's technically not a hop kick. Actually, has the read on a lot of situations over here. He's outclassing Hafez Denvir right now, which is something I never thought I'd see. Nice throw. Oh, man. 
anyone can do it, it's Mama Kazama. Shh, don't spoil the tournament. Come on, man. God damn it. Don't spoil the fucking tournament. still has signs of life, needless to say. Right, one round of peace over here, Office the Mirror. This is critical for him. He needs that wall break. Does not, not get it. Does not, does not anticipate that. Lee Chao Lan's gonna have to do some renovations. Gonna think that wall break's coming. Oh, look at that. All right, launched up. Gonna be taken to the wall. Side wall does protect him from that end of that combo. He's in heat. Takes a four throw, broken. Oh, he's just burning his heat over here. Damn. He did burn it out. He's got his Rage Art ready, though. He definitely saw it because what he mentioned has not happened yet. So he definitely saw it. Come on, man. Oh, wow, nice. Gets it with a down three. Very nice. Cool, calm, collected. Cool as a cucumber. Gets that second round. All important. Alphastonvir <laughs> needs this round. It would be amazing. You talk about things that haven't happened yet, then you're spoiling. Period. That's it. Oh, gotta watch out for that. Anyway. Right Back now, to whatever it. Jun does in heat, she will not be losing life. Look at that. Yeah, she's one of the least popular oh, of the probably so top tier characters. Already in heat. I say probably because you're never really sure until the game complete your boss. But probably top tier, still relatively under chosen. And we go down to the final round. Set point for Osama. Hafistan V gotta hang on. If he wants to stay in this tournament, back three. Make or break for Young Tanvir. Let's see what he can do. Osama with a very good start to the round has that heat engaged. Yeah, <laughs> okay, Gannon said, why is it good? Jun's the final boss. She, I'm, try, I'm trying to tell people, I don't get it, man. The characters that people think are complicated and hard are actually kind of easy. She's, she's so easy. She's so good. What a way to go, indeed. She's so good for how easy she is. It doesn't make any sense. And she got tricks, too, that people don't use, right? Like the Sabaki that you saw him use. The full oh, crouch ones, powerful, the up four one. My God, this Ten frame crouch food that knocks so, down and does so 36 well. sub damage. Just That's obnoxious. This. That's for real, dog. How difference in the eight between the good and the bad characters? So there is a difference, okay? I'm not going to try to tell you that King's Heat Smash and Jack's Heat Smash are not better than, like, you know, the Heat Smash of low-tier characters and things like that. But generally, if you understand the other guy's character, and you're better than the other guy, then you can pick almost any character and beat them. But it really depends, you know what I mean? Depends on your knowledge, too. You gotta have no gaps in that knowledge. What a G, and let's welcome in the legend himself, Soul Dragger. <laughs> what's up, what's up, guys? How you doing, brother? How are you feeling? I'm doing absolutely great. Uh, right in time for the big match, Kasim yeah, uh, Arslan Ash. Let's freaking go. Feeling great, some characters, one good. thing about this game Office that I don't like is that down. some characters that might be attractive but, to you uh, as a noob yeah, are sure. not necessarily good for learning fundamentals. Victor's a perfect really example. Are, like, yeah. Victor's a very attractive new character. He has a short move list. He got easy stuff. He got a combo that involves press launch and then just do twos or something dumb like that and you get a combo, right? Then uh, stuff like that. So he's got some stuff that's new attractive. But then although he does have good footsie tools, he doesn't necessarily always teach like good fundamentals. Also, he's lacking in certain things. He doesn't have like a full throw game mix up like some other characters do. Do he don't got a lot of knockdowns in his punishment list too. That's rough. Oh my like God. he doesn't oh, knock oh, down. Oh, when does he oh, knock oh, down in his punishers? Oh, Let me think for a minute. God. So jab punisher doesn't knock down. Twelve frame punishers. He's got the two two two. Right, that's a stance mix up, and then he's got the other one, the D1 plus two. 13 frame is down for a 1 1, right? Is that his best 13 frame punish? He, his punishment is kind of trash until 15 frames. And I would like to say the 4 4 1 is not bad because the heat engager, right? But then, how come he doesn't have, does he have, does he have a 14 frame that knocks down that I'm forgetting about? I gotta check, check it out, fam. Um, yeah, doing a great job, fam. No we wonder I put him in B tier for punishment. Together. That's exactly why everyone loves you, fam. Much love, and here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let me tell you about some other characters' punishment and what they can do. At it. So, with a mirror, let's get right in. Oh, yes, thank you. Thank you, Toko. Okay, he does have a 13 frame, a 4 1 1. Thank you, that knocks down. I was about to say, ugh. Oh, God. That's terrible. No knockdown between 1 and 14. You gotta have something somewhere. Oh, 4 1 1's not bad. That was pretty good. 
should be wow. It's confirmable if you mess up too. That's the real tech. Is that move? That's the the, the move that is the the secret move of of becoming like a master victor. Is that a four one move? You know the perks of seeing these? It doesn't look fancy at first. He's just a dorky little huh. He just stabs you with the the, the edge of the sword. But it's it's. I think it's actually a better move most of the time than his regular down four one. These guys know each other so well. You best believe. Just because you have the whole hit confirm mind game behind it. These guys are the I know, man. That's why I say it's the secret move, right? You understand too. But that that's the a four one one. That's the secret move as a victor player. Is that move? You master that move, and then you you unlock a, a whole other world of victor. Okay, activation. Focus on me. Good start for Arslan Ash. Okay, very nice. Arslan keeping things really simple, not trying to overcommit. Because he's already easily Good crouch. Go, so this is the Arsene versus Casimir, top 16. No, As we said, Amir again, Casimir. by the way. This, low, low. Oof. No, no. Casimir gets around back. Yeah, there's a certain wall pressure that, you know, forces you to eat this. Yeah, yeah I, I like that move back one. It's pretty cool. It's not I mean, fancy. That's the problem with it. It's like it's, it's like a good annoying poke, but it doesn't. Really, this game has so many good like setup pokes, right? And that one, it's not really like good for a setup outside of you, if you take the risk and go to stance, right? It's more good at you do this and then you know you poke at them for a while. But it's a good ass move. Just because he had already used it's more like a Jayu move than like a nutty move. That's like a like a move that a Jayu would have, just annoying mid that creates space. Hard to punish. Makes me think of Jayu's whole move list, basically. Nice. Ah, Kasim. Not cutting loose. Would you consider this an upset if Kasim knocks out Arslan? Nothing is an upset. Nothing's an upset this early. It's true. He's right. It's way too early. Yeah, I mean, you know, a lot of these guys, you know, work really hard on their game. Did I check what they changed? You're talking about for the upcoming patch? Yeah, I've seen it. They changed the running 3-2. This finally might be the nerf that finally stops it. So now uh, it has less travel distance at the end of the move. And also when it whiffs, it has it has the, the special electric recovery, as I like to call it. They do this to moves when moves are too good. That's how you know they're trying to nerf a move when they do this to a move. And that means that when the move whiffs, only when it whiffs, I think, it gets five frames extra recovery. Do I have that part right? That's like the electric thing. When you duck an electric, if you notice, they, oh, he kind of stays out there for a while. That's because in the game it's programmed so that it has, if you make it whiff, it has little extra. Otherwise, you'd never be able to punish it. It'd be too good. He could have, you know, made it back, but unfortunate that you know um he got caught in the air so yeah that's exactly what i was just talking about i believe it's is it five frames of recovery in general or five or five frames of of recovery on with because if it has five frames actually recovery in general then it's not even plus anymore is it so much pressure on your shoulders to keep carrying that back what what is it now on block is it more than plus five on block is it that obnoxious hold on stop um yeah i mean it's is it really more than plus five? Come on, too, that will hurt my head. You know, in Pakistan, it's it, he I'm about to check. To, you know, that's I always kind of assumed it was plus five because this game is just plus five the game. Because you've got so much competition here, and that's what you know helps him improve. And welcome to the stream to you, you. Thank I'm you so much for running. Team. And we're really looking forward to have you here. Where in the Pakistan fuck is it on the list? list. So don't miss out, everyone. You know God you damn it, I hate when you go on these sites and they don't have all the moves. Where's running three? The most fucking okay, important move on the character the move list. Why would you not? There you go. What's gonna happen? Okay, activation. Oh, it can be up to plus seven. So are they making it zero on block? Is that what they're doing? No way, right? Very nice. Beautiful sidewalk from Ursulan, knowing that, you know, he can and he did. Wait, the first hit of running three two is ten frames? No way. The more you back him into a corner, the more he performs. That can't be real. That's true. Oh, nice Very block nice. by Gossam there. Good reel in that low. No, 15 frames. Okay, I was about to no, say. The second oh hit is 10 God, frames. That makes sense. Because she does the need to... The hide just comes out right away. Okay. Wow. That's I was about to say. No fucking way. Or it's 15 frames. So, it's... It can be it, it, it can be plus seven in rest, but usually it's plus five. They're so defensive, defensively There's a world where it can be plus seven. Don't make it plus fifteen. It's plus enough. Awesome, doing a very good job. Arslan cannot drop any more rounds at this point. Oh way! Oh my God! I was thinking that he's gonna get in the air and get the. Oh, that makes sense. When the knee misses, it gets the five extra frames of recovery. Oh 
Pressure, See, there you go. Because oh, first no, the knee's just... going to whiff, and then the two won't come oh, out because the knee whiff. That's the first property, right? Oh, my God. Kasim is fucking him up. I'm over here talking about nerves, and the Arsenal's dying. Maybe Azu Center really was broken. They weren't They weren't lying to you when they told you Azu Center was too good. So good that even a champ is getting fucked up. Nice, beautiful side. Oh you my goodness. Yeah. That's, that's the did they stop Azucena spam? Well, the, the patch is not out yet, so no. In fact, we're seeing Azucena versus Azucena. This is make or break. Absolutely. Make or break for Arslana. Hopefully, RK Gannon. Hopefully. They said that last time. So don't mind me if I'm a little skeptical until the patch comes out and we actually test it. Because last time they said, hey guys, look, we nerfed Azu Center running 3 2 for you. And it really was not very much of a nerf. Very nice. Arslan definitely needs this. Running 3 2. There we go. Spends the heat. Yeah, her basic tech and moves are good. Oh my Good days. discipline. You can't even you can't even compare her to Josie. She's more like Katarina. Like Katarina just had dumb moves and strings, good lows, good frame data. Damn, is he done? Is he dead? He might be dead. Yeah, may not be enough for the kill, I guess. It's gonna take all his great life though. Never know this game is crazy, bro. Oh, oh, just oh like my that. God! See, Can you come back from this? Oh, no, that's a mid. It's a mid. That was too hard to guess what was coming. Would you believe that? Unbelievable. My days. Normally, I would be like, "All right, they got us on the next patch." Except, you know, they they told us once already they fixed this move. You better yeah. believe he's gonna come in with a vengeance, cause this isn't the but guy. But you gotta admit, like you know, they'll fix this move, and then Lily will be back to breaking the floor two times on floor break stages. Oh so, God, no! Please don't let me wish that into existence. That would be terrible. Oh my God, the Lily double floor breaks like Forgotten Realm. That would be horrifying. Taking me as your disciple, and he said, "Bro, you are our master." Like that was that guy was just being nice. But that's not the truth, bro. Yeah. All right, well, Arson's out of there. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Arson lovers. He had to take the L. Azucena mirrors. Just mad Azucena's in this tournament. Here we go. There's at least right, four good go. ones that we saw. Hunk is out against a cyborg. This is Resident Evil. Yeah, the, the, the good part is that some of the characters that I'm scared of, people are bad at playing. Like, I'm I'm for real frightened of Jun Kazama, but most Jun Kazama players are trash. I'm sorry, no offense intended, guys. But for most Jun Kazama players are terrible. So, you know, even though their character is so scary, they don't know how to pilot them, right? In Pakistan. Nice. You know? he has Yeah, he's out. Unique. That's how he got so good, ZZ Forever. You got a late ZZ Forever. You got to understand. He got so good because all the rest of the guys where he's from are so good. Now, just imagine if all of these guys could also get a visa and travel all over the world to play just like how he does, how good they would all do. They'd be, they, the top 60 would be all these guys. Let's go, Hunk. Even but Korea and Japan will be struggling for wins. Oh, NA, you better pray and for wins. NA. We all know, you know, Samurai has the best combos under his sleeve. They'll laugh and be like, so you're praying you to the wrong god. You're praying to the Christian god. You we can't got, beat us. Got every combo every <laughs> Let me stop. <laughs> because he's a combo artist from the FTC. I'm not religious. I'm just joking, guys. Don't get mad. Ridiculous. Yeah, it's not just the, their government, too. It's also the rest of the world is just cautious of, yeah. of just... For whatever reason, Pakistan. I don't know nothing about it, so I don't know why. Just know that Pakistan visa or Pakistan passport has trouble getting into a lot of countries. That's just how it is. That's the part that matters. It's not the why, it's the, the, the fact. The fact is they have trouble getting into other countries. Very good discipline and defense from uh, Zubair. Not trying to cut. Nice, very nice. See that? Yeah. Like, you gotta trust even the last chip. And that's exactly what... Man, you, you know, the funny part is you, you, you're you not even getting mad about the right moves yet, bro. You're, getting, you, you're, you're focused on, like, the can-can and the down forward 2-1, which that's a good move, don't get me wrong. And then what's the other one that scrubs like to do? They do the three-part string. They do the huh, 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 and then they either mix with the command grab, they do a mid there, they do a low, they do a bunch of different stuff. from Or they do the double mid, the kicks, that's a heat engage. They do a bunch of stuff off from that. Dude, that's only the layer zero, bro. That stuff can be countered. 
two apiece. One person's gonna go one match up. That stuff yeah, all has counters. What's scary from her is the shit that doesn't have counters. Like the, when she starts just playing safe and punishing all your shit up four at one over and over and stuff like that. That's the stuff that you can't do anything about. You do a minus ten and she says, "Ha ha." My Get God, your ass across the screen, dummy. He fixes his angle? <laughs> I love you, Dragonov, so oh. much. Let's go, amigo. I wish I could play oh. with you, bro, but you oh. know what? That 1-2-2 two, two two string, how many highs I are in that string? Oh. Yeah. At least the third high. Is it, is it two highs? Three highs? Is it all high? 1-2-2, two, two, the whole thing's high? Or is the two a mid at least? You see that? Everyone in this game. Uh, you can counter that string. Trust me, guys. You can destroy her for doing that over and over. While rising four because that ain't the scary part. Is a mash heaven. Yeah. And uh, Zubair, I mean, just getting it done. Oh my god. Love it. Zubair gets that first round over Somrek. They're gonna go for. Like, imagine eating the low and then you know hitting with a while rising four. <laughs> And this works in this game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's the good part, Iris, is that if you learn the matchup for Reyna now and you understand how the character works, then later it'll benefit you because Reyna's popular pretty much at all yeah. ranks, all tiers of rank. Go. You're gonna fight Reyna players. Very nice. Axe is you're gonna fight so Scrub ones first at your rank that they just pressing their good buttons. They don't really know what they're doing. Nice. They're just doing stuff that they saw somebody else do that they think is good. Okay. And then later on, they're gonna fight like the super that? good oh, ones. No. That they kind of know how to use their moves right and hit confirm late. them. Yep. You gotta learn how to how to steal steal a turn back from them. That's hard. But sometimes you can. Sometimes you can steal a turn back from Reina. The main time is after four four two. That's a, a, a turn steal moment, depending on what she does. So you can't terribly do much, but here we go. My dude has the best combos, and you can. You just learn how to up your percentage of four four two, guessing when she's gonna go high. Or blocking a low, yes. you know, when All she doesn't right. mid and you block, it's yeah. minus. You take that time and you try to just don't let her re engage for free. The bear still has that heat. Beat her to the punch Beautiful. after Talk that. On that. He was expecting that, okay. Still got the raid though. Get himself off the corner with that back 4 3 engager. Oh my god, wow. the fuzzy. He got schmixed. He didn't know what was coming when. That's what Dragon Off does. The mixers come at you so fast. It's not that they're launchers. It's just that they're all chunky. Every low or mid that he does does damage, and then he has good strings too. His strings are cheap. My God, he's getting greedy. He got strings that you have to know the answer to, especially the, the what is it, the back four two one as a scrub. Oh my God, as a, that must be a scrub killer. That string. Oh no break on the throws. Okay, could this be a turning point? Oh my God, he burned all the bridges. I can imagine back four. Oh my god, let's go, some red. Bro, drag dragon on back four two one. Oh, he's still alive. No way, bro. Don't let him go. No way! Dragon off. If he breaks the wall, it could be it though. No! Wow. Whoa. Beautiful stuff. That was sick. That was scary. You probably just need this round, fam. You gotta trust yourself. Hell yeah. For the burst. I mean, Brian has counters for Dragon but it ain't easy. You try doing this. Oh Look at this Dragon coming at him. This Dragon is ridiculous. Yeah. He's changing his timing. Everything's nice plus. Twice now. Oh my God! You can't keep doing that, bro. You're gonna die. Toes. Oh my God. Okay. Plus. Activation. Guess. Oh. The bear. Too strong. You know. Damn. Too sweet. That Dragon was nasty. Notice, um, it's pretty appropriate. Bring into from summer and that was, that was okay. I think it's just like if I compare that armor move, okay, cool. He got like a mid and a knockdown. Let me if I compare that to like I don't know what's the thing that a character could do geese like counter that would back turn and give him plus 15 and let him get a whole combo. I know they know it to 14, but still doesn't favor. Brian is just weird. He's so hard to be like good with. Let me tell you that. Even if, if you've been playing Brian for fucking 15 years, it's hard to be good with that character. So I've seen that happening. So I'll trust. And Ahmad Brian is playing Devil Jin, bro. It's okay, real Mike. You'll figure it out. a bad guy. What the hell? If you if you play Tekken enough, you'll the, the, what I'm saying. The words that'll start coming out of my mouth will start making sense. But Jai, you switching sides like that for no reason. That will never start making sense. Don't worry. That confuses everyone. That's why they pick her, because they know she does those things. previously, making it to this point. Risk it again. Ooh. 
Bro, this smash. Definitely. And, and Tech and KOF. They're really good at KOF out there. there we go. yeah, they might have other stuff too, like but Tech and KOF right. are two big ones. Into the heaven gate. Nice. Back four. Very nice. Demon Steel pedal. She's so tiny for the Demon Steel pedal, though. Nice. Ducks it this time. Tried to fake. For the rising option. And, uh, settle with it. Shit, I, I bet the curry is Not delicious. I never had Pakistan it. curry, but I bet that shit's godlike. That sounds yeah. good. Okay, very nice. Nice. We saw this exact sequence so nice. much by Iftikhar in the last match. He's so good with that. Risk Throw. it again! Oh my Whoa, God, Xiao Yu! <laughs> How do you just Honestly. go under heat burst like that? Nice. No, stop what? it. Tasty webs, oh, baby. Spider Man. Mm. Damn, that did trash damage. Go go oh, Correct punish. That was smart. Damn, this this devil gen is good. People don't punish that move right. He did a big brain punish. Good. The cameraman is on this guy's side. What's happening? Holy fuck. There's no bracket rebrand because I don't want to spoil the result. So the bracket's not up. But this is the official channel, so you can go watch it later if you need to rebrand. Here you go. This is the, the channel. So later on, if you want to watch the whole archive, just go here. You can see everything that happened. Oh, Nice. Nice. Beautiful. One, two. Caught him decking this time. Activation. The engager incoming. Still got the heat intact. Here we go. You can't be moving good. around. That's too right. Much sure can. It tracks pretty good, and it beats so, it beats their armor yeah. too, which is nice. My turn. Dead. Good confirm. The you know they confirmed it when you see the tss, like he does the, the stagger hands, like he's waiting for a long. Then then you see the two. That's how you know they're making sure. Yeah. I'm just gonna be honest, bro. <laughs> AOP down one plus two is safe. Shit, man. Missed. Oh, oh my Big God. miss. <laughs> wow. Well, you know, we're talking about Pakistan specifically. So I've had Indian curry, you know, but, you know, I've had, you know, Indian curry from Pakistan or Pakistan curry or whatever. That's why I'm saying I will try it. Whoa, see what they taste like. Different, any, different flavors or different spice or whatever. They're both cooking. This shit is crazy. The jai has been getting hooked up by the by the, the cameraman. That's the only thing. Good block. He could have done, done watch any 4 4. Oh, he still got it. He still got it. Takes it. Gets it done. Super effective. Bro, this win pose is so cool. Yeah, the moment the moment where this double gen won me over was the correct punish on that. Xiao Yu low. A lot of people don't punish that, right? And. Is definitely show you for a reason, but we can't him having the, the special, the Kazama. What is that? The three one or whatever that weird string is having that punish on deck. This guy's ready, Shayu. and we're about to see him do that magic right now. Here we go. Although he's oh, one nice. game down, it's a must. That, that's guaranteed. Right so we'll definitely see a different side of the Shayu now. Here we go. In heat, Coming let's low. see if we can use it. Using that low twice. Definitely a model. Read that. Yeah, that's the name. Three Ring Circus. Kazama String, right? I learned it from you, Mom. That's what I think whenever he does one of those weird Kazama moves. Nice. Learned it from you, Mom. That's when she's like, Jin, where'd you learn that? In the middle of the back turn stand. As she does can cans and kicks the fuck out of us. When he does the can cans. Jin, where'd you learn that? I learned it from you, Mom. You could also apply that to Asuka. For Asuka, I like to say that when when uh she does the was it the forward four the Sabaki move and the Sabaki's do a jab and hits them in the face and she gets a whole combo. Should be able to Asuka, where'd you learn that? I learned it from you, mom. It's ridiculous. Okay, seven golden letters. Muy perfecto. One one. Very nice. Great comeback round from Irtaza. Likely to construct from here in rounds. Good break. Game wise is one zero. Oh, 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 another combo. Seems to be working these uh, yeah. grabs. Yeah, yeah, the Jinrei you know? grabs. I mean, he's been doing it quite a bit today. Yeah. And it's working for him. Still has heat. Both yeah. guys still have heat. Ready to be engaged. There we Let's go. Again. Webs into plus frames. Nice. That was smart. Eight frames, baby. You better do something quick. Oh, you better. Oh, no way. That's crazy. Shimbori, oh, please, what's wrong with the stages in this game? <laughs> no way. Wow. 
I'm not sure. <laughs> that was cheap as fuck. That whole combo he could have, but maybe he didn't go for the tornado. Oh, shit. Uh, I mean, technically it hits and it slams you into the wall, right? So that means that a wall breaks. That's so cheap. Yes, let's do Oh, my God. <laughs> Nicely done there. Ooh. What was the right punish? Oh, it's they're going, they're going full ham now. Nah, they're losing. That means Honda go crazy. In a good way. Yeah. Nice heat activation. Oh, Guess my God. Whoa, well. beautiful block again. This is the third time he... Ooh. That moves. That, that's the, the best move. When Yo. they do that to kill like that, oh, but he didn't actually kill. Could have launched, but he didn't need it. In and out, Brian, really, really, okay, really. Final round, set point. That's that for real. Is the the be when they're scared of everything else, that's like the well, best move in this whole move. Shark. That shit will catch you every time. Who's gonna duck there? Oh, everything crazy. else he does is mid. So you'd have to be a maniac to crouch there. I mean, you'd have to be for a maniac. That's the only way. Who would crouch there? I mean, what the hell is that? Yeah, oh my guys God, have their heat engaged now. Okay, keeping him in the corner. Smash. Here we go, bro. Really? Let's Delhi Ninja? Oh God, Remind me about it. What channel? Okay. Yeah. Today on Monday? Or do you mean soon as in coming up soon? Because I'm not, you know me, I'm always down to, to see some tournaments. I was going to wait until tomorrow and probably enter the, the is tomorrow temp. I never received yet. TNS Tuesdays, right? I was going to enter that and see how I do. The good man turned into bad. Okay, word. Remind me about it, and if I'm still alive when it's on, I'll check it out before I tap out. Oh man, that was that the end of the bracket, or was there one more? Okay, I'm gonna try to figure out where we are in the bracket. Hold on, oh, it's still a top eight qualifier. From here on in, it's gonna be yeah. It's getting to the, it's getting to the point where the true gods and killers are showing up. Even Arson got taken out. It's not that he's not. He won the whole fucking world tour, so he's the he's the oh, 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 oh. he's sitting at the top. But you know what I mean? That's the problem. That's why I he's like a titan, and these these are the gods fighting to be a titan, just like he is. That's basically what I'm trying to say. You know, when you are at the wall, absolutely amazing. Let's go. It's Kusama Abasi, of course. These guys are super good. Taking on Extinguisher, Extinguisher one of those guys. Damn, Duff. I think that kills. Jesus. Wow, I didn't even see that route before. That was new to me. I didn't know she could do that. That was that was a guaranteed wall combo, huh? Holy fuck. Don't worry, guys. One more patch. One more patch, guys. Don't worry. Bro, I don't know this guy. And he's sitting in freaking top eight, bro. That's amazing. Top 16, yeah. Top exactly. 16, yeah. And um, this is this is exactly why. I 3 p.m. Pacific, 6 p.m. on May 4th. Abasi just running rough shot. He was able to deal with, like I said, Alpha Stenmir, who's one of those, one of the best. Okay, the finale is is on wow. May 4th. Okay, I see. I don't know if the rest of it's happening later. It's already started. It sounds like. Breaking the stage hazard here. First coming out. You can't. They can't have qualifiers in the finale and then all you, all you. What do you win? A year food supply? Okay, actually that's not that bad a prize, I guess. But then you still gotta go to Chipotle every day. That's annoying. My God, he has almost got the heat as well. They're not battling my dumbass. That could be all she wrote. Very unfortunate for extinguisher. One's battling to save her son. He's consumed by a double gene. The other one's okay, battling the for her coffee bro. empire. You know, you made it They're definitely not worried about Spooky. 15, bro, the next tournament, you're going to be in top eight, bro. It's it's fine. Just okay, you also get 20 grand. And you get to go to Evo? Right? That's sick. Okay. Great players, you know, hey, that's what I'm saying. I'll take free Chipotle every day. I'll figure out the right amount of cheese and guac and, and meat and seasonings to make it healthy for my diet, and I would eat that every day. The factor was amazing, man. I'm so sad that that sponsorship is almost over. Thank you so much, Factor, for real. That was great. They sent me free food. Like, four of y'all bought a box of it, which means I get hooked up for that. Thank you to you know, everybody that bought a box once again. And, man, the, the food was so good. I'm sad that I ran out of it. I feel was basically eating on their dime the while hell? the sponsorship was happening. And they paid me. That's fucking nuts. I'm really happy. Thank you, Factor. Let's go. High pace, high action.
and it was delicious. Every it was so delicious that I looked at it and I almost went to reorder. And I looked at how expensive it was, and I was like, man, I don't know if I can keep this. It's delicious, but it's too pricey for me. Back in tag one. Those guys were so if strong. If only I was rich. That's what I was already thinking. If, I was, if only I was paid, this shit would be an instant snap. That's where he got discovered. Yeah. And what okay, a very pick nice. up the by the way. Yeah. Look at this wall. Whoa, using that it. was a good combo for a bad access. Okay. Extinguisher doing very good nice. here, but he gets that health oh back. Does Osama oh, oh, He went for that downfall one, two. Okay, Osama not letting it. Not letting it slip. Ooh. Very nice, beautiful. Should be able to carry slightly shy. When you said he knows nice. how to cook a meal, you meant yeah. literally or was that a metaphor? Like I'm just <laughs> No no no. Basically Kashmiri food is really good. Oh okay, okay. So I'm just referring Oh, okay. to oh shit, nice. It was a double reference. I love those. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> but then I realized, okay, T is overrated. Because yeah. <laughs> really, T is really good, by the way. By That's the it. Dragger as he's sipping on tea. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like, no, he actually is a cook. Love Love it. It. Very nice, beautiful. <laughs> no break on the throat. Ooh. Should be able to close it out because he got the... Uh, yeah, that's still, that's still pretty good. 20 grand prize. And you get to go to Evo. Whoever wins, you get Chipotle for life and all that. That's, that sounds like... A, that sounds worth entering and trying to win. But I'm pretty sure that the reason why he probably ought twice to break on oh, oh your the, face oh, right in the lava that was a floor blast i yeah. didn't know that yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah all the oh, kazama throws hey. jin can do it asuka they plant you face first into the lava yeah. Dominant. oh look at that good stuff extinguisher Yo. still signs of life here you we can tell go there's urgency careful there nice running through you Nice. She's saying eat this in Spanish, but it sounds weird. It's got like a weird accent to it. She's saying, come at this or eat this. My God. That's what it sounds like to me, at least. I could be wrong. And it happens all Her accent is weird, so to me, it sounds like she's saying, con queso, which means with cheese. She's flying at you with the knees, and she's giving you the knee and the elbow, and she's saying, here, take this with cheese. But no, that's just my head cannon. Samabasi can potentially close it out and join his fellow Ashes teammate, the John in top eight. But Extinguisher is not going to go out without a fight. Good sidestep, but he's too far to capitalize. It is pretty cheesy as a move. The distance into Liberator. Ooh. Oh, wow. wow. Saw that high eye with the wide eye. Let's go, amigo. He's still keeping him in the corner. Yeah, very sensible. My nice. goodness, nice. can, nice. can nice. kick. Nice. Nice. Every day, this might be enough for the kill. Can he? And yes, he Damn, can. sick combo. Oh, no. no! Okay, not, not, not sick combo. Not sick combo, but he's still punished. It's okay. <laughs> His fellow Ashes teammate, the John in top eight. <laughs> that is awesome stuff. Great game. Was that the last top one top of the, the, the qualifiers, or is there another one? The yeah. I'm waiting to see when's the last qualifier match. Then, this might be the last. Okay, this is this has got to be, right? We've been and seeing a qualifier match forever. Yeah, it's got to be the last one. Gossim's tea, or I was just saying Gossim coffee. is literally <laughs> betraying his tea with the coffee? I'm telling you, these guys are got like, oh, and coffee. Gossim was so good with the Azucena against our Bro. Con queso, yep, here she wow, goes. Con queso, and then she gets a whole combo because Azucena. Too many hits, because it's a two hit running through two. Um, you know, no. To Boy, too right. slow, man. You know what? This too slow, man. Girl definitely ruling the game right now. And, um, yo, look at that range on that paw. No circus for you. Here we go. Ah. Should be able to get nice. a normal mm, wall. Now. What's the oak keep? Stop Beautiful it. Getting himself get your ass the, back on this wall. Uh, They're lucky they didn't die for that. Breaks it. Oh my God, that was meant to kill here. them. Okay, burst coming into play. Yeah, nicely Holy fuck. Fight, having the stage nice. hazard in the background. That was really You see Demon's Breath? Yeah, this is Kuma's Breath. Say, Watch your toes. Mm. And that's all it took. One low hit and Kuma... Asad Mughal getting on the scorecard. Kablan. Yeah. Oh, nice. But it, it hit airborne, so no full combo. Keep engaged. Yo, the range cover of it, that paw again. Yeah, thank you so much. Leave me alone. Probably not the best stage, but here we go. The activation with that launch. 
and it's not gonna be a smaller combo, bro. It's gonna take Ooh. him to the wall as well. And the wall hazard might just wanna use the. Oh wow! He should have full charged it, maybe. Engager towards the end, but wasn't really able to close. But it's still on. Nice. Oh True. my God! So he has so, he has so much grain. Oh. Nice. But here we go, Asad Mughal. Why, why am I more scared for the bear? It's a giant bear. I should be scared to, for the crazy coffee Peruvian lady. So unpredictable. That Kuma, this is not something a lot of players I imagine have prepared for. Especially if he's wearing the Luffy hat. I mean, oh, come on. Hell yeah. What are you going to do about that? Yeah. Oh my god, these paws. All day, bro. Whoa. She's not going to get bursted here, but here we go. He went for the whole string. Got away Only with minus that 13, I think. Beautiful duck. No, I think, I think it's only 13. So and the force crouch. Oh, okay. oh. Opportunity. Oh, that wasn't no the right combo. Here, but, but he still, still got it. Doesn't matter. Headbutt to close it out. Asad Mughal taking the first game against a beast of a player like Kasimir. This is ridiculous. That is really, really interesting. Asad Mughal just knocked off Kasim in the first match. This is going to be a different I think it's free, Juice Day. Not a lot of walls. You know what I really if it's an online tournament, it's probably free. Because most online tournaments are free he nowadays. There's very not few not online scared. tournaments he's to actually charge you. Even if you're yeah. a Salon Ash, he's going to play like this, bro. That's how he's it should so be. so ballsy, man. No respect. You cannot give respect to these big names, if, especially in this game. You don't need to. I mean, look at that. Gossip yeah. starting good. Bing, bang, and a boom. Mm. Bigger stage, Soul mm -hmm. Dragger. Who is this mm -hmm. uh, I think it definitely favors uh, both. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> because Yunakuma does have a very good engager ender, and he that leads to a lot of uh, OKZB ah. options. So I'll take... Oh, my God. Try to go low. An, it, oh, he tried. He tried. That could have been a very good splat if Kasim would have eaten that. He was a little bit Let's see, low to start for Kasim. Craftier. Yo, nice. very nice activation. With He's the, good at that. It's 13 frames, so it's pretty quick. It's not a bad mid to do. Oh, nice oh, throw wow. there. Couldn't really break it. Slightly late. It's bad on block. Good timing. But not like end of the world bad, just bad. End of the world bad is is his down 4 2 1 and some of his other very moves. Nice. His the, the 111, I think that's also oh, nice. Oh, that low. Those are, oh god, don't let them block nice. that. Spends it beautiful. No liberator. One plus two. He was Ooh, probably wasn't no wrong punish. To... Hmm. He tried to launch it. Fight. Nice plus frames. Yeah, you want to press button? Here comes my Hihachi pause. Here we go. What? No power. We take it. We we'll take you those. You gotta be kidding me, bro. No way. Just like that. I think Gossip okay. suddenly Having a very good start didn't deal with all this with, uh, running through 2 PS like and a quick string. Does shot of espresso right after that last loss and come in with such a motivation. Does her down for 1-4 like Gossip fucking jail or something? Oh, How come nobody ever nice. crouches the second hit? Yo, the I'm saying that more sarcastically. I don't think it jails. It's just goddamn. It's hard to cross that move. Oh wow! Whoa, that was such a. Oh, it jails! Oh, that's grimy. Definitely what the Kasim fuck? Definitely. What's wrong with Azucena? Has a certain plus frame pressure that is really great in like near the walls and everything. Yeah. But um, yes, having okay. That's so grimy. State, I guess, and really chaotic too. So what the fuck? Who gets a mid high from down for one that jails? Who who gives that to a character? Now I understand why you're complaining about this character Maybe sometimes. Yeah, that was good. That's crazy. Who gives that to someone? Low connects. One of my favorite stages in the music. That's oh, funny because I fight her so much and I never really thought about it. About that gelling. I just fight her and I don't think about it. That shows you most of the Azu centers that I fight are terrible. They don't even abuse that shit. Boom. To the wall, fam. Bang, bang, boom. Nicely done. Look at that. Take that booty as well. And where you looking? Twerking his way to victory yeah. is Azu Absolutely. One apiece. This is high stakes. Yeah. We've got That's was so crazy. Yo. All this time, all these Azu centers just been doing down four, one fours. And in my mind, I was thinking for a while after a while, I was like, how come nobody does? They do it every time. <laughs> it's breakable. Bad position to be in. No, the worst oh, position. Oh, shit. That throw. Now he's in the wall himself. Sick with punish. 
definitely get a game two. Trouble they could do a cool ender. They didn't go for it. Oh, they did go for it. Technically, that was cool. I'll count that. I'll count that as a cool ender. Gossamir is one of the, according to Arslan, one of the best Tekken tag yeah. two players. Didn't really have a great run Tekken 7, apparently, but look at the form he's in right now with this game. Yeah. Very nice power cross. Okay. Still not bad. Bigger plus frames this time around. Take that activation. Slap. With that power crush, hell sweep. Bear paws. Nice heat activation. Uh, yeah, she has the, the, the high as a launcher. She has a mid to the mid thing. Nice it's gonna, that, that, I think that string oh, is almost the same know. as a Josie string. But Josie's didn't jail, right? That's the reason why he went for that blank launcher. Because Josie has almost the same move in Tekken 7. Pretty sure it didn't jail, though. Maybe I'm wrong. Knows when to take the risk. Asad Mughal definitely need to do something here, bro, bro because this Gossam's is looking found his really bad, man. Gossam is in Knowledge City with the character. Oh, beautiful. Stay in the air, fam. Beautiful. Very nice. I think that was a... Man, do you, 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 you don't, you don't, you know nothing. You stay. Let's go back to Tekken 5 and talk about the things that characters could do to you. <laughs> Shit, even Tekken Tag 2, I used to do this to people and I would shake my head when it worked. I would just, as Lars, be a Above their head after knocking them down somewhere and just do down back two one above their head and it didn't matter what they press wake up low kick wake up mid kick try to just get up anything they press anything free combo they just got up into my hand and just picked them up so calm so cool just able to get it done hats off they took that shit away thankfully no no weird free combos like that those were the horror days man and it's not that I didn't like Tekken back then but whoa trying to get up in Tekken those days was terrifying. Good luck getting up. Got a Chinese man, Kung Fu Master. Aslan Ali. Let's All right. I'll tr let me try to figure out where we are. I have the there. photo, I think. So Aslan Ali. Counter hit. Nice. No berry. Yo. He wasn't five. winners. Ooh. Nice and losers. That means that this is took it out. I think this is the la this is the last match because the A loser A goes to loser of M and this is Superia. Okay. So this should be the last top 16 qualifier to get into top eight. And then after that, That's let's have a stretch it. break and a smoke break and whatever yes, else you guys need, is. snack break. And then so we're going to watch the top eight. Yeah. The first match. And then after that, I'm going to go back to playing more Yu-Gi-Oh. You guys don't have to watch it if you don't want to, but that's really what I'm going to do. I'm going to play more Yu-Gi-Oh. I was getting a little bit annoyed playing that weird pendulum deck or whatever, but I still was having fun. And, uh, you know, rest in peace for Dragunov's actual voice actor who's dead. This is a new one. Actually, so, I need dinner. That's a lot. So. Man in the heavens. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. He gave us some great memories. Yeah. He never uttered a word, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah Tekken six laws was. I didn't realize how stupid he was. He was dumb. Bro, I didn't know enough about Tekken back then to understand how dumb Tekken six laws was. Bang bang and a boom. Nice. nice. So sway cancelled sidestep into down forward one. Let me Jesus tell you about the tech, that Tekken 6 now that I'm thinking of. Let me tell you about when so Boko Ho 1 was a counter off. starter. Dropped around, but they took that shit away and never gave this. it back. Nicely challenged with that 2-1. Gets that. Good There's stuff. not even a reason to press Boko Ho 1 Yo, anymore. You always nice. do Boko Ho 1-2 or very something like that. Not letting it slip. Beautiful. Yeah. Still got. Nice. I knew that was coming. GG. Here we go. He's uh, he's believe it or not, fan. To my head, he's like one rank past my victor already. Getting something together. SNL, he also one of those guys who's he's only two down ranks down. away from yeah, what's the tech, the first special, right? Tekken King. King. He's two ranks away no, from Tekken King. Can't be committing that twice now because so he's doing all right. At the higher level, it's gonna get bombed. Nice, still keeping a heat. Very sensible. Very, yeah, not very bad. Sensible, I'm pretty happy. I, I learned a lot about him. At least now when I fight an Eddie, I understand what they're doing. I can say clearly. There's, if there's no way that I don't understand Eddie by now. Has he pressed buttons? No, no. It might be so... Close. Close. Man, this dude's going to end up in top 8, isn't he? Just dragging our player. This is definitely going to be amazing. Like, Do I like him in this game? I never tried him in Tekken 7, so I don't really know what he was like. But as far as a random character for me to try and play compared to Victor, he's really fun because 
with Victor. I didn't really think about it too much as I played him, but, you know, I've been playing Tekken long enough that when I have a character that has a short move list, sometimes that's a little restricting. It's like, well, I only have these moves and that's all I have, huh? Really with Victor, he has about 15 moves that are good, and then the other moves, you can you can sp sp spice them in sometimes and have the situation to be all right, but really you should be sticking to the best 10 to 15 moves probably with that character for the most part at the high level, right? And uh, with Eddie, no, Eddie has a lot of good moves, and he has a lot of different things you can do, too. He has so many moves and so many things that I don't even see the same two Eddie players. Or I don't see two Eddie players even use all the same moves. That's how many moves he got. And then he has new moves that are good, too. That new down back 4-4 thing is mad good. You got a duck, and then the new 4-4-2 four, four, is good. Minus 9, double mid, that's mad good. Oh, my days. Just one step closer to close it out. And definitely need this round. His new handstand is is good, but it's hard to get into it. If, he wins uh, if the other guy knows what's going on, it's hard to get into handstand. Well, but you have stuff like the running three. Running three gets you into handstand kind of free. And if they block it, and so you have that to help out. Back in Taken Seven, when you're in minus frame. That oh, means hold you're that in top. trouble. Hold it's getting close. He has to leave. Oh, yeah, nice. Final round. Like an yeah, so this Eddie, he's better at stepping. That's a thing. But to, to compensate for that, uh, this Eddie's RLX is not as evasive as the old Eddie. Although you can still go under stuff with it sometimes. Especially highs. But like mids, the old RLX, they were, had like designated mids you could go under. The old RLX. This new one is, is not as good for that. It's done! What? So, Power Mel, it's not that I just started. I, I would play for a while when it first came out, and I saved up resources, but then I never really made a deck because I just chose not to keep playing. So then I came back, and I decided to make Sword Soul because it was kind of easy and cheap to make. So that I'm putting resources into Sword Soul. I'm almost done. And then after I make Sword Soul, I'm just going to play that whenever the season ladder resets and just use that to get gold and start building towards other decks. That's my plan right now. <laughs> But you gotta appreciate Now, I, I know what's going on already, Paul Mills. I have more problems with, you know, when you play the solo mode, it gives you stuff like uh, play this weird, terrible pendulum deck and figure out how the fuck it works. By the way, our tutorial is ass. Like, that's the stuff I'm having more trouble with. If I could just take Sword Soul and just play that one Sword Soul deck in all of solo mode and beat all of it, then I would do that. That would be way easier. But that's not how solo mode works. Stack, stack, stack lineup. But we're gonna make you wait just a little bit. Not as big as five yesterday. Minutes. So that's what I'm working on right now. Keep on working on solo mode. I think they're going to take their break now, right? Okay, so here's what we'll do, chat. Let's take advantage of this five-minute break to also ourselves take a five-minute break, all right? So if you guys need anything, you know what to do. Go get a drink. Go get a smoke. Do whatever else. And come back and see me in a few minutes. Go. This is a designated break. I'm saying go do it right now because Spooky said so. If you stay here the whole time, you can also subscribe to the channel. Or you can also, when you come back, if you want to subscribe. I'll be right back, everybody.
I'm making a quick snack also, guys. So don't worry. If the match starts without me, I'll just come back and I'll rewind a little bit to watch it with you all. Just give me a little bit. I'm starving. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back as advertised. Five minute break, no longer <laughs> than that. We are keeping the action rolling today. Top eight's done for Havoc 3, first dojo in the history of Pakistani Tekken for Tekken 8. Man, that was insane. That was insane indeed. Yeah, I mean, we saw some great action, and now we come down to the cream of the crop. The top eight, the final eight players that are going to go into Havoc 3, and one of them will have the chance to be able to join the boss gauntlet lineup of 16 people that are going to duke it out for the ultimate prize. Exactly. High stakes. Right. Let's not get any bigger than that. So the brackets, ladies and gentlemen, let's have a quick look at those, shall we? So here Absolutely we are, as you see insane. in front of you, these are the guys that are all the way up in this in this competition. Yeah. The final eight. And what a final eight it is, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, before we get into the matchups, even if you just look at the names you have in front of you right now. Someone like the John, who's absolutely wrecking havoc. Someone like Qasim, who's absolutely been unblemished with his Azucena. Someone like Osama, all three members of Team Ashes. Someone like- For uh, Zine. Yeah, for Zine, who's been absolutely unblemished. Isharib, who's had a really great run. And now these matches go one by one. First one, of course, for Zine and Isharib. I mean, that is a match and a half, man. Yeah, but man, seriously, I mean, like, even in the loser side, man, this is insane. We saw Arsalan Ash, the greatest of all time from Tekken 7. He took a fall yeah. against Gossam Me, right? Yeah. The guy who is in Team Ash is his hand picked coordinated person. Yeah. And now we're going to go into the next match. The first match of the top eight. It's going to be for Zine. going to go up against Isharib. Man, this is high stakes. These are. Two really high level guys. Both of them have had such a good run so far. I don't want to pick favorites or anything like that. Maybe we should do predictions. I don't know if that's the ethical thing to do, but Farzine has looked so, so good. He's looked like he's been on a rampage, which he has been. I mean, this is just anyone's ball game, of course. It's too soon to say who's going to walk away with the whole thing, but the form Farzine's been on, man, it's oh, been crazy. Oh, for sure, for sure. For Zine with his victor has been absolutely flawed. Which character do I think is going to get a buff next patch? You know I don't know. Was there anything mentioned other than Azucena running 3-2? Victor 
fits him like I know there was there was uh, a mention of a balance patch after Evil Japan, right? And Who do I think Alyssa is most likely to get puffed? Earlier, Panda, strong with an Alyssa, and Shaheen, Leroy. Pocket, which is arguably, you know, an, an even better character to go with, depending on the matchup. But man, Alyssa, Those are probably the most likely to get buffs of some kind. No probably not Panda. They're just going to be Panda be bad. Shaheen or Leroy, they might get hooked up with something. Victor. We'll have to wait and see. And it is going to be quite a match as these guys check their buttons, get ready for the action. Victor's already locked in from the side of Prazine. Now, Shara, it's his decision. What's he going to go with to be able to face the leader of the Ravens? It's going to be Alyssa, looks like it. Yeah, he used Most Alyssa. characters are good where they he are. The Brian, he did a very good I job mean, it wouldn't hurt Brian to give him a buff. Might make him stupid, but you know, whatever. There's a lot of stupid characters in this game already. If you're going to have stupid characters, then. Vacation fit for Victor now going into that tactical gear. You know things are getting serious. When <laughs> oh, yeah, he's geared up and ready to go. And a shot at better watch out because, man, Barzine, he's going to break his A game. In fact, both of these guys are going to bring their A game, so they watch out. Better watch out. This is top eight, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah, dude, Steve, right I would now. never play Steve Let's in this game. Going. Stop even when I see someone else play Steve, I'm just like, man, you like the hard knock life, huh? Match here for the top eight. All right. Winner semifinals, everybody. Once again, this is the Tech of the World Tour Dojo event. It took place in Pakistan yesterday. Uh, and everybody gets TWT Dojo points. Some of the best players in the whole, 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 whole country, no joke, are here to show what they got. Gonna be making this really and out of those. There's a Victor shot. player, is which is crazy. Be hit. Oh, the whiff at the last second. The tech roll. Nice. Counter hit. Still in it. Rage art. Early rage art. Oh, oh, and a whiff. oh, what a tech roll in reverse by Perzine. Man, that's the old man just Starting being slippery. How about strong. that? Man, that was intense. That. I didn't know the old man was so slippery. Intense. I thought that was yes, Alyssa's job. Perzine keeps that momentum going, takes it to the wall, gives him the business. Oh, nice. Oh, oh, that was the perfect oh, answer to that. No wall breaks Dead. in this level. And my I don't God. know if he's confirming it or he's just guessing up 411 and it's working, but it's working. For him in the he's just doing up 411. That's just catching him. Man, for Zine, you cannot cut this guy out. I mean, like, you know, there's no Arcelon in this tournament, so this guy, <clears> he could be the one to take it all, setting okay. up comfortably in winners. Wow. Right, right through now, the down back four like it wasn't even there, huh? Making a statement, making sure that he's That's one of Alyssa's, I swear. In Chainsaws. We forget all the other bullshit, the dub mid and the lows and everything. The best move in Chainsaws is that stupid auto sidestep move. That move is nonsense. That move is like a double auto sidestep. It goes so far. Excellent conversion. Takes it to the wall and gets beautiful damage off of it. In a very good position to be. The Chainsaws are out. He's got to watch out of the sidestep. Perfect. Yeah, he found the new Akuma. It's Victor. I'm just kidding. He's not broken like Akuma was. Nope. Stops halfway mid. But he got teleports and he got fireballs. Technically, he shoots you with the gun, just like Akuma. Those are fireballs. Oh, oh, that was mad damage. He's in rage as well. Oh, sick punish. That was godlike. Again, got your legs. Now the leg, huh? Final round is shot at Scarface. Sharp's doing good here. This just shows that you know, like man, it doesn't matter who you are. You gotta watch out. You gotta keep your head in the game. Even if it is for Zine, whose victor has been absolutely... Are all of them safe on block? Not all of them. Yeah, yeah. Generally, with all with high power crushes in this game, they have a tendency to make high power crushes safe on block. With mid power crushes, it's a toss-up depending on the character. Goes in, not letting up in the slightest. A lot of white life on the side of a shot. I've got to make something out of it. Nice. Sharib still He's has a chance here. You knock on him out. For sure, for sure. Look at that. Rage Art activated, but not used yet. He didn't use it before. Not a lot of health on his side. No punish on that hop kick. Not a lot of time on his side either, but look at that. Yeah, Good but time. doesn't Finn get, doesn't Finn get like a state clock. power question back it turn or something weird right like now. that? Or he gets two power questions in the back turn? He, he is something stupid in back turn to compensate for that. Perzine's so calculated. You saw him starting back steps as soon as the time was about to run out. Made Isharib rush in. Then capitalized on that. That is a tactical master. He is on his toes at all times. That is for Zine, ladies and gentlemen. They're going to go to state select. Looks like they're going to keep the same characters. Absolute precision from my man for Zine over here as he makes those perfect cuts with Victor. Taking Isharab down to size. But Isharab not down and out yet. 
He's got his own bus saws. I will give you this, M. Freeze. I will give you this. It's funny to see so many characters in this game that are straight ham and they're straight YOLO, and then they made Feng have to have to have back one be safe only in block when he's in heat, and it takes some of his heat more and stuff. That's not YOLO. That's weird. He could do some nasty stuff at the wall, but again, the shot of Zalissa. She has the space. She can do. She can make it hurt a whole lot. Low to start for for. So I will give you that. That's that's strange, but whatever. Fang, Fang got Fang right don't got too much master. to complain about in this game. Fang's but in a pretty good spot. Wants to be able to make his mark early. Both of them almost neck and neck. The shot of getting a slight lead. Oh, unfortunate from Farzine, but then he does capitalize on what comes next. Takes it to the wall. Yes, absolutely. Bam. Four, three, two. Heat activated. Sidestep by. Ooh, not not important. Don't need to call that. <laughs> he already finished the round. <laughs> Beautiful stuff there. See, that's what it is. It's over before you know it, and it is fast and furious with these gentlemen. And that's what you like to see, man. That's how you want your top ace to be. You want them to be exciting, electrifying. Yeah. You, know, you want you want to have something on the level of like UFC 300, man. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me. One started, thing no. that that helped no, the aggression. I never really thought I'll about it, <laughs> but thinking back now, it makes a lot more sense. You know, they kept nerfing stuff like they made magic fours instead of being 11 or 12 frames or whatever they are, depending on the character. Now all the fours are slow. And then even the characters that get magic four, like a counter hit four that does something, it's almost never a true combo unless either they do a follow up that commits or something like that. Like Jun Kazama got one of the best ones because she gets the four and then she gets that the, the OTG afterwards. But it's blocked out by she gets like 48 damage or something from Wants Magic 4. But most characters mounted. don't get something good Mixes like that. Up. Oh, gets the that was sick. Grab. In his face. How'd they know to do that? Explosions. What kind of genius shit was that? They just knew a power crush was coming? Oh, oh. See, this is what it is. These guys are just flying all around. The counter hit down back 4 is going to give Farzine a lot of purchase into the wall. Yes, it is. And that should be it. Wow. Man. Farzine don't give a fuck about your smart stuff. Beautiful work, man. For Zine is one of those guys that makes you want to play, wants to learn yeah. Victor. Not that you know, like I don't think Fang is too strong. No, I don't. I don't think he's too strong. I think he's good. I don't think he's too strong. I think Fang is. It has weaknesses. If I was to compare him to Dragonov, I could look at Dragonov and be like, "What's Dragonov's weakness supposed to be?" Versus Fang has like clearly weaknesses. He got stuff that's not safe on block, like a lot of stuff. Even his lows, like some of his lows are real bad on block. And then he's kind of linear too. Sometimes his tracking is not that spectacular. He got tracking that does stuff, but he can be stuck. You don't want that. You don't want that. And for Dragonov is the one that I'm looking at. I'm like, how? I just gotta be better than them. Huh? That's the only way to beat them. And everybody else just like, yeah, you just gotta be better than them. That's the only way to win. With the victor. Beautiful. He is the victor. He is the victor. I like that. For sure. Beautiful for stuff sure. there by Percy. He's setting almost like a, a roadmap on how to play a victor at a high level. I mean, he's just like I said, yesterday in the pools, no problem, breeze through everything. Today in the round. To me, Feng is like Jun Kazama. Like, I would probably put Jun Kazama in the S tier, but then I can at least look at her and say, unless they play the most ridiculous Tekken that you're supposed to play with Jun Kazama, which most people don't do that, there's clear counterplay to most of the things they're doing. There's only one word to describe his victory. Inspiration. Yeah, inspiration. That's what it is. Inspirational. This guy, you see his victory in action, you want to play. As the same with Feng. Like, even with Feng, even, even though he's an amazing character, and I agree with y'all, he's probably like a, a top five. I'll, I'll put him. He's really up there. He's a good ass character, okay? I'm not going to put a number on him. I'll just say he's good as fuck, right? But regardless, he has counterplay. Dragonov is the one that will. How are you supposed to counter this character? I don't understand. Thank God they nerfed some of his combo damage. Imagine if he still had what was a stupid combo he had before that he would get uh back four three after or something like that. I forget what it was. It was thank God. Oh, Orbital into back four three. That was fucking nonsense. Thank God they got rid of that. He had all that shit and you couldn't do lows. That was terrifying. Now at least you can do lows and not lose seventy percent of your life. Subscribe to Baz on YouTube or Twitch wherever you're watching. Baz is bringing you this action. They're taking Pakistani tech into the very next level. This is the first dojo in Pakistan. Over a hundred people registered and showed up yesterday for the pools. All of this leading up to the Baz Gauntlet 16 of the Reina sometimes feels like she has less counterplay than than Feng does. What's the counterplay to Reina? Just doing four four two and guessing right every time. There's no counterplay. Or you, she guessed right every time. If you lost. 
All right, right now it's gonna be Nomantro. They're bringing out the Steve Fox finally. It's gonna go up against the King. The lore is on set on your screen right now, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get the action rolling. And there we go. Low counter hit right off the bat. And with that hit, look at the damage that's been done. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh your head. Don't move, John buddy. Does not want to let up at all. This is a really <laughs> he tried to catch him crouching. That would have been sick. Yeah, and I believe No Mantra Ultimate got the better of John. He's just going in. It looks like the John. He's, he's trying to bait a Rage Is that his gimmick? He does that to bait Rage Rocks? That's pretty nasty. He came prepared, man. All these Ashes guys learned from their mistakes from Baz Fight Night. How Fist and Veer got defeated by Osama. Now we're seeing this. But, I mean, it's too early to say No Mantra Ultimate has been absolute. Yeah, it's funny because where the fuck did she learn that from? She definitely didn't learn that from Heiachi. Because Heiachi don't got no demons, Paul. what it is. Hey, I actually be showing straight underarm when you press 404 too. Where did Reyna learn that move from? And you know what? It could be anyone's game right now. And No Mantra is showing his metal. 100%. As we go into it. All right. Takes it down nice and easy, ladies and gentlemen. Steve Fox on the board. No Mantra is making it look Damn, easy. Damn, and that again, seat, that's pretty goes nasty. The double Jaguar step. Here we go. The John in heat. Oh, gets that running shine. She learned it from TikTok, says Wishcraft. That's how people learn martial Every arts nowadays. Just loves that move. Every wrestling fan just loves King. Oh, yeah. In the old era, we so didn't have TikTok. So that's why, that's why, instead, we had Steven Seagal. That was the old era of fake martial arts. We had Steven Seagal. Yo, you see Alpha Justice, bro? He stabbed some guy's hand with a knife. Alpha Justice. You'd be like, I thought this guy's a martial artist. Why is he stabbing people's hands with knives? Don't worry about it. Steven Seagal. The funniest part is the part where he drove he drove the car on on the, the tracks for no reason or whatever the fuck it was and fucked the car all up. Alpha Justice. This movie's too funny. And you know what? I really love the you know the blurring of these lines. Between actual combat, e the combat Ooh. sports and esports, RKO, three most destructive letters in all sports entertainment, and out of nowhere, that Rapid that King Assault really or Rapid King Onslaught. I said it wrong. My bad. All right, the John up nice. against the wall. The heat burning out, and the activation comes out. From it do feel like King oh, be hitting you with some Rapid King Assaults. He just be Smash. doing this shit. Look at his life. Is Boom. Why do you so much health? Going for the low, but you didn't block while I had heat, dumbass. Right, now you die. Faces the wrath of the king as the John takes it to the final round of this first game between these two. High intensity, high stakes. Oh, pedigree, no, 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 pedigree, baby. Pedigree. Mm, on the dirty oh, yeah, ass carpet. Pedigree. Classic. That's Sorry. nasty. I'd be extra mad just because that carpet probably the smells. The Let me tell you about musty carpets. They smell nasty. He just runs. He wanted to go for the RKO, but I don't think that worked. Hey, just dashes in, and there we go. The smash coming out. God damn, why does it do so much? I know a lot of moves have that in this game. 13 Sonata, that's just this game. It's not like King is the only character that gets that. So the day after, but no man is gonna close it out with a simple one, two, the most destructive combination that you need. Let me tell you about the, the, a sound effect that you hear from Jin Kazama that's gonna give you nightmares, all right? You hear, huh, 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 when you hear that sound, you lost 54 life for no fucking reason. That shit's dumb. One of the best music in my opinion. He does the flip at the end. KO. That, that shit 90% of the time it kills. That's how much damage it does. I love to be able to see more action over here as we go into the second game. No Mantra Ultimate gets an early lead. That shit will give you Jin nightmares. You know what? That's something that John can make up for. No worries. Just dancing around. Using movement to their advantage. Both of these guys showing a master class in how you actually move in Tekken. Oh, floated out of the air. And the wall's right over there, so the combo will be short. Woo! But the damage will be significant. He engager is just crazy too, okay? And I don't necessarily mind, because whatever. I get it, that's the game, but... Damn, plus 17, huh? Good block. Three Jaguar steps back. Just in case you couldn't figure out how to do a mix-up, we're going to give you enough frames to do one. Just in case you couldn't figure it out. All right. Maybe. John M freeze. I'm not too good at judging that type of thing. Maybe. Very good adjustment, and there we go. The activation coming out. Dashing into the other wall. Maybe they keep nerfing Steve oh! because Steve players keep figuring out how to fucking know. Never mind. Never mind. Oh! Steve needs buffs. Who would have thought, man? Rage art could have been sign of desperation. Understandable. I mean, John was on a roll, but that heat smash, perfect timing once again. Hey. Ooh, almost got that throw off the Jaguar step. Uh huh. 
but he is in heat, so you gotta watch out. Whatever the John chooses, yeah. he can go in for the power bomb, and even if it's blocked, there's a mix-up opportunity, and you gotta watch out for it. All right, John's heat is gone. The Mons is here. Oh, nice. Got him. Check so my engagers, so you have to know the difference. There's a heat burst engager where you burst and then that engages heat. And it is where you actually hit a heat engager. When you hit an actual heat engager, no, that's just fucking plus 17, bro. If it actually hits. Yeah, it took me a little while to process that. Like I you can just look at yourself like and continue. Like you don't believe. I mean, like these guys, you know, they've brought the action so much that, you know. That's you like, you, that's game universal. Awesome. Every character gets stuck. Understandable. I think everyone will know that's understandable. Look oh. at the quality. Of Perfect example. Pause. Sometimes they do same, down 4-4. Four four. Oh, the hooks are And then after down 4-4, four 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 you do the forward 2, you know, and then you get the knee and then engage the seat. That's, yeah, that's like plus 16, bro. Plus 17. Plus a lot. If you can't figure out how to mix from that, you, you need to train more. Boxing clinic. Master flat. Floyd Mayweather-esque. Mike Dyson-esque. Just no man esque Sonic. Van coming out to close the deal once again. And Aman Chaudhry on set point over here Ooh. on the verge of taking the John down to losers. Nice running, shining wizard. Excellent work. Oh, Ooh, there, we, there go. we go. The arm grab does not commit to the It's good to differentiate because when they heat burst, right? Or when they heat burst and you block it or it hits or whatever, it's nowhere near yeah, that plus 16. It's really like plus one or plus two, right? And plus one or plus two, depending on the matchup, they can press something there. <laughs> okay, well, I think you got, I, I think you got the macho man in there in your hulkster. In your hulkster, yeah, he mixed up the character, but that's okay. <laughs> Let me We're go going old school, so it's fine. No, man, I love that. Oh, that would have been I sick. But instead, driver to the muscle buster, all these other things. It's amazing. Damn, he's throwing every he's, every throw possible at him. Back one counter hit. How how is this Steve winning? I don't even understand. This guy feels like it should be he should be like dead five times over, but he did it. He won. How the fuck did he do that? With the down one plus two, and there it is. The this guy's a monster. Secures the victory. Montrose, you're coming out here with a vengeance. This guy's actually a, a demon. Holy fuck. He's in top three. Steve is top three guaranteed, chat. Can you believe that shit? Oh, the character that we, five minutes ago, we were saying, this guy might need buffs. This guy's in top three. What buffs? Close your mouth. Do subscribe to either the Twitch or the YouTube, wherever you're watching. I have to plug this stuff because we got to grow. And here we go. All right, now it's the top tier show right now. Oh yeah, the low, the low heat smashes, they're all around. Does it get different for them? I think they're all around minus 12. Maybe it's different for different ones, but. When Azucena comes in. Oh, there we go. Nice counter hit over there for Bablu. And Casimir launches him up and goes straight into it. Activation on his side. It's an open stage. So there we go. That's the optimal combo to go for. Nice, nice. Minus 14, damn, that's terrible. The mid kick, and there we go. That secures the deal. They don't want you to mix up as a Kazuya Look player. Holy oh, fuck. Minus 14, huh? Meanwhile, Jackie smash. Adaptive, he can make those adjustments. Dawson must be riding a high man, defeating Arslan Ash. Regardless of what his form's been in Tekken 8, beating Arslan's is such a big morale booster. Of course it is. Right now, he has to deal with Bublu, who has taken down a beast of his own might. And oh, there we are in the backswing blow. We'll close out the second one. Very stylish. That's what as a center. Yeah, Victor's is terrible on block. They really don't want you to use that move. They're trying to tell you as a Victor player, don't use this move. Except when you when you're desperate for a low. That's the only time to do that move. Bubble with Victor, they, they, they give you other shinier moves like the up one plus two and heat, and then the down back one plus two. Those are his real. He, it's like Lily. Lily's the same thing. Lily don't even do her heat smash. That move sucks. Ask any Lily player. Where's a good Lily player in the chat? Lily player, do y'all use Lily's heat smash? Just, Tell the truth. Just with that final. Y'all don't. I know y'all don't. He dashes in and secures his victory almost. And there we go. The toes. Watch your toes. They just use sidestep three plus four or whatever it is because it's basically faster than the heat smashes. Her heat smash is mad slow. It is the perfect blend. You are right, Queen. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> I'm not, no, oh, man. Absolutely, I didn't know about half yeah, these these Pakistan man. guys. I knew about some of them, <laughs> but right. these guys. When the chips nah, are down, I don't know nothing. You bring out the strongest, this the is one that you know me. with, and that's what it is right now. Here we go. 
Okay, now look at that. He's starting off things. Oh, he's moving. Sway cancels. Sidestepping like a madman. Already got I love the new, the running against the two new that he has. The awesome. The Ooh, sound it makes when he slams you is, is great. I could hear that for hours. Activation. Awesome. <laughs> Fisher split herself for the ball. Phoenix, let's see if it pays off so far, though. More of the same. Oh, oh, oh that no. was unfortunate. You thought you could wake up, kid? You thought you could wake up and do something? Get nice try. Is one of the most critical things that you need to learn. Nice try, in dummy. Tekken 8. In any Tekken, actually. Especially in this one. Let's go up against the wall. This is where Gossam likes to be. So good mixing up those highs and those lows, man. Block, but still in a lot of trouble is Zubair. Zubair wants to be able to go for some safety. Yeah, the dojos were great He's last year, you say. Honestly, the dojo idea has been great since the beginning quickly. of its inception. But last year, it was fun to follow along. This year, is going to be especially fun because of the new game. So they're now we get to see styles and we get to see maybe, oh, this in this region, they're going to, this character that we normally don't see, that type of thing. Like here we saw a Steve. I mean, you know, it's rare to see that anywhere does. in the world, a Steve that's any Sway good. Activation Let alone a Steve that can make top nice. three in tournament. Those cap, cap kicks are actually chopping him down to size, so you got to watch out. Literally half his health gone just from the calf kicks, man. Think about that. Woo. Oh, nice. Wow, wow he actually went mid with the power core. Interesting. Okay, this is his life. And there we go. Launched up, scooped up. Maybe. And he could be able to get something if he get, takes it to the wall. Nice. Yes. Nice. Done, Mr. Phoenix. I like that he didn't nice risk doing a rage art just in case. First round in his favor. The two Sick. But he's still got a long way to Can go. Can he carry? You got a carry combo? He does. Round of his tournament life. Ooh. So you got to watch out if you are him. Because I do not want to be He's making a it work with this ball. Let's go. Round against Gossamir. Hmm. Let's the take it old school, baby. I've been oh, here dude. since the beginning. Mm. Oh, mm. oh, perfect answering so strong. This is why I'm here every year, baby. And now Look we're down at to the me. Final round. It is make or break for Bablu. I feel like I gotta retire the boy for a second. I'm like one punch no, Joe. No, no, no. Just keep it, keep it going, man. We all love it. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Chat letter letter boy know here that you know Muy Perfecto <laughs> is in it to stay. Let's show let's show some appreciation for our first time commentator Maximus <laughs> over here doing an excellent job. What's up, God of Misfortunes? How you doing? There's Gossamir though. Ooh. Oh, ho, ho. crucial, crucial, crucial! Oh, the hammer of the gods! Very nice, beautiful. I had held my breath over there, man. Well, that was insane. Like three straight, pardon me. Three straight. Yeah, you know, yeah. I'm not saying you should hurt yourself doing it, sweep? but if you're doing something that's hurting your hands, then you might want to practice man. it you know first off, like practicing in training mode a lot, and then try to try to do it until you feel like you're doing it in a way where it like hurts you less or like you're not like like straining whatever muscle you're straining. I know that's weird, but staying alive, you know. Cause you know how it is with your hands, they only have a certain amount of strength, so you can work them out some, like with hand strength exercise and things like that. But after a certain point, if your hands are hurting doing something, then you're doing it wrong, probably, or you're doing something that's gonna get you in trouble later. Carpal tunnel's a bitch. That's the only reason I say that. Like with me, I'm fortunate so far. I don't got no carpal tunnel problems. I got some shoulder problems here or there, but nothing that stops me from playing for long sessions. So. Head movement, Dominic Cruz esque. There's that heat. Smash to start. Engage, pardon me. Low calf kick again. Oh, nice. He gets that heat smash. Nice work. That's going to put him in a comfortable position. But again, can't stay so comfortable Ooh. because Azucena is coming to town. He's got that rage art. He is going to use it. Beautifully done. Will it kill? That's a question. That's a good question to ask. I know for sure that that white life is all eviscerated. One, That's not even, in, in, in the, I hate that they do this in Tekken. They give you English subtitles, but the subtitles always take liberties, right? So like in that one, she like in English the subtitle says, "How do you like your coffee?" But that's not what she says. She just asks you, "Do you have coffee, dummy? You got coffee? Boom!" It's like when they say, "Got milk, right? Got coffee?" That's the whole joke. Instead, like the translation like ruins the joke. I feel guys, like they know their way around the stage. Oh, calf kicks, man. Those it's almost like the old days of RPGs. Remember, people would are, are, translate the RPGs all wrong. Wooziisms. This time it is serious. Let's make it or break it for Bablu. But he's been able to come back from this exact position in the last game. Absolutely. We'll have to see if he can do that, work that magic again because he desperately. Oh, your base. Exactly. 
that's basically what's going on there. Oh, but, good for Bublu. but if he can turn it around, he can definitely do it. No way. Right. Pushed up against the wall and now enraged. Oh, oh, watch out. Good. He's gonna get <laughs> there we go. Gets they don't even translate Jin's intro right. We'll have to go the cure, no, with the cure force yet they are all they don't they they've, they've never translated that correctly since day zero. So Bublu, what they tell you he's saying, I'm telling you as someone that knows a tiny bit of Japanese, that's not what he's saying. He was able to stay composed during these tough matches. The last game was he said something cornball and the, the English trying is like feel my wrath or something cornball like that. That's not what he's saying. People have been able to do it, but I mean hats off to Kasim. What form he's been perfect form i believe you know like this is him at his apex right now i mean like even though he he's really saying he's really saying basically i'm gonna kill you this is, this is the way more or less he's basically saying, i'm, I'm no you're gonna die i'm like about to kill you and azucena is the one to be able to get in there so ladies and gentlemen the next match is gonna be up it's gonna be hamad brand gonna go up against the young kashmiri master this At tournament, Zun Shia here, I'll link you to the official so you can check it out later. This is the Pakistan first dojo event. Oh, you don't know what dojos are, Zun Shia. Well, Tekken World Tour has four levels of tournament. The lowest level is a dojo tournament, and then there's the challenger, there's master, and then there's like master plus, or something like that. So this is the lowest tier event, but it takes place in Pakistan, which has some of the highest tier players. In fact, the tournament, Arson Ash, that's famous for winning Tekken World Tour last year. He's already out of this tournament, which gives you an idea of the level of play. They're really good. Relentless, right? He's been one of the premier Bryans after Bilal sort of fell out of shape. But you know what? It was always amazing. It was always wonderful to see him. I believe that he did win a couple of tournaments back in the Master, no, the, the World Finals is the actual World Finals. Master Plus is Evo Japan, which happens in two weeks. That's a Master Plus. And then uh, regular Evo that happens in Vegas, Evolution. That's Those are the two Master Plus. The main finals, I don't know when it happens yet, but... The main finals, it'll be somewhere, and there'll be a last chance qualifier, too. That's always what they do. And then whoever had the most points at the end from the dojo, the challengers, the master, and the master plus at the end, they'll, they'll all qualify for that. You missed the Tekken 7 one not too long ago if you're new to this. The Tekken 7 one just finished. How long ago was that chat? Three months ago? Something like that. The Tekken 7 one just happened. It was fun. We watched pretty much the whole thing. I was there. I had a good ass time. I streamed from it, in fact. I had a little IRL stream with my phone and people watched some of the matches together with me. Almost. To the window, to the wall. Nice. Well, we all know what comes next. I can't see that. Anyway, if you're into that type of stuff, this is the right place to be. Let me tell you, Zhangshi, if you're into this idea and you're into fighting in tournaments, from here, you're going to learn about a lot of players and you're going to know who to follow and you'll find out about all the other tournaments and all that stuff. That's usually what happens. This is like kind of the gateway channel that people figure out about local events near them or how to get into the FGC, that type of thing. Man, what a character. June, I mean, just so versatile and so unique in what she brings Damn. to the table. Sama's Mad damn it, she's dead. Really I, I, don't, I still don't know how I feel about the stage interactions. Maybe that should do less damage or something. Poetry it just feels too good. That is what I can just, uh, say to describe this. Every time that you get one of those combos, it always feels like, haha, I win now. I wonder if he's going to force the Brian out. But this Devil Jin is still very good. I mean, there's still a lot of... You knew to Tekken in general or just to Tekken 8? Maybe the Brian might not come out even if my Brian does fall because he is very comfortable with Jin so far. Nicely done. Nice work. All right, goes for the activation. Goes well, straight in. Oh will man, that was that was all guaranteed. That's cheap. You know, he does finish that combo, and there we go, Heaven's Gate. Aerial headbutts. Man, it's so nerfed. Oh my God. That is exactly what Brian does. I'm not saying unnerf it or nothing, but at least make it do more damage. Gets himself on the board, and there we go, the electric. If you're not going to make it one combo or anything anymore, it, it does pitiful damage. It, for real, it tickles. That urgency from Ahmad Brian, man. All of a sudden, he's alive. He's awake. He's ready to go. This whole patch, just p flush it. Flush this whole patch. That's what Aris would say, right? Flush it. Just flush the whole patch. All right. Two, two in rounds. The final round comes out. Hopefully, the next patch is better. Best heat smash in the game. Absolutely. That's, that is, you know, that gives you extreme advantage on block, leads to a mix-up, and obviously covers almost the full screen. I mean, what more can you say about that? Samano trying to get back in it. Heat engage, has him up against the wall. What can you do here? Good block. Good block. Damn, mad damage. And he gets a combo, no, that's Dude. gross. John Kazama. <laughs> make it count now. 
Gotta watch out for the toes. Trying to stay nice block. Pieces, oh my god, the heat smash and the wall combo, that's that's too much. Stop. Rightfully so. Rightfully so. Deservedly so. Uh, sometimes Zunchia. So we just had a patch come along, and they were supposed to try to fix one of Azucena's moves, and it just kind of moved that the community has all been complaining about, just like everybody online is. And it's the Azucena, the running three-two, which is a it's a running mid that jails is plus seven, and when you sidestep, it's hard to whip punish. So the first attempt to fix it, which really was not much of a fix, although they tried, was they tried to make it so that when she does the running three, if it whips, the two doesn't come out. Well, guess what? That fixed nothing because she still just flies away. All that did was stop you from getting punched in the face from the two for no reason by trying to sidestep. So now the next patch, they're going to finally fix it, hopefully, so that when she does running three, uh, it has less travel distance. And then if it whips uh, just the three whips, it has like extra recovery, basically. So now that's their way of fixing. Hopefully that works because the move is just kind of godlike right now. She's not even the best character in the whole game. That's another part. But she definitely has a top five move in the whole game right now. That move is insane. Does not have the key to be able to take Sick care of punish. There we go. She said, huh? Go the sweep, very Don't short touch. Range, yeah, too good. Basically said they ended up buffing it. I mean, more or less. It, it basically, it, it, the fix didn't do anything. Oh, I'll, I'll leave it at that. Both versions of the move suck. The first version from the previous patch the and then the version in this patch are both dumb moves. Take it to the wall and give him the business. Nice block on the low, but nothing going from it. Osama seems like he's on a roll. Nice step four. One straight in. Oh. Hey, and there it is. Damn, this guy's too. He, he even his strength choices they make no sense to me. This guy's he's way up there with the Dark Zama. He don't do no bad guesses. Look at that. Finally, he got low powered. Some aesthetic brilliance. But it was a low wall, so no combo. No worries though, he's still in it. Nice. Nice work with the flash punch combo punish. He activated. Back one two. Didn't get a clean splat. Oh, that was a good rage art. That, that was a very good rage art. Oh danger. Good versus evil. He's gotta bait the heat burst. If he if he baits double gen heat burst, he can win. Will he bait it? Here it comes. No. Couldn't survive. Still alive, staying alive. He's not going down without a fight as a mod Bryant. Absolutely, he wants the evil to prevail. And there it is. Engage. straight in with a heat engager. Damn, that pushback is crazy. He even he thought it was okay to do something, but it wasn't. It was a bad idea. Nice block. On that block. He could have done sidestep two ferry and gotten a better carry. So that was still good that he punished it at least with the wall standing three. Back as well, but Hamad Bryant still in it. Hamad Bryant still in it. Ooh, Unfortunately, not showing enough patience that this could spell one chance. He He's got heat, right? What can he do with it? Anything good? God, that mm, I don't know. Oh, this is not I don't know cool. if this is enough. It's gonna take his great life actually. This is not bad. Kill, Just take the gray. Eviscerate a lot of that white health. Goodbye. So now it's time to make or break. Will he one guess? Or will he fall? That was punishable. Oh, oh my god! Oh my days. What a comeback. The unkillable Clutch. double chin. But it works, it works. Yeah. And there it is. That's what you like to see, KO. But the fight's not over yet as we go to the final round. Not it's make or break. Distance, man. This is crazy. Oh, that's terrible. You guys got lucky. He got lucky as fuck. What the hell? How'd that even happen? Not able to fully capitalize on that, but oh, Sabaki. Hey, I'm the original. Okay, you gotta watch out now. Don't do not press any buttons. Do not be very, very. He burst. It's coming. He burst back. They tried to do it. They tried to do it. Uh oh, he has so much life. Oh, one chance, bro. No way. No way. For Hamad. It's duckable. Oh no! Done, done. He crouched. Ladies and gentlemen, young Osama That was sick. Damn, really good match. he's a prodigy once again. He's been great today. Beautiful. All right. Let's keep it going.
out in front of us on a tournament. Stage. Damn, D this guy's eyes tell you everything you need to know. This dude does not sleep. Look at those bags under his eyes. This guy only fucking plays Tekken. Holy shit. But there is a difference now. This is for Tekken World Tour points and the chance to be able to get. Oh, I'm from so Sophie. I'm originally from New York, so it's like a northeast kind of accent. So does the John. So we'll have to see who prevails amongst them as we go into the next game. You know, this guy's been doing nothing but practicing all night long for like five days in a row. He's like, I want to win. Oh, it's Kasim. Was that Kasim Mir with the eyes like that? That's crazy. Using that power charge. That Zangief move. That's what I'm going to call it. That's Zangief move, man. Because that's exactly what he does. That guy for real, he, he did not sleep for at least at least five days. Oh, that's, that was the John. Okay. Wow, sick crouch. He got. Can I go back? Did he get hit by it and crouch standing? No way. Stop. That's that's high level. That's so hard what he just did. That's incredible. Holy fuck. Oh, here we go. F5? No? Oh, oh my yeah. days. That is an F5 conversion into a spine buster. Beautiful stuff. <laughs> yeah, beautiful work. So that move that was down forward 2-1 from King, the gimmick behind it is that when it counter hits, see, when it counter hits, he gets a guaranteed combo. But then when it normal hits, the combo's not guaranteed. So actually, especially if he delays it, you have enough time to crouch like that. But still, to be able to do that, that's Omega hard. That's sick as fuck. What's gonna happen? We'll have to see the combo still going. Oh, nice block. Okay, Gossam here does get the health back. And the mix-up. Wow. You gotta watch out now. Wow. Oh, that was impressive. Word. JNS90 said that, according to Spag, a story that he's heard Spag tell that these guys don't the sleep. They only play Tekken. The speed of Asana, that's an interesting docking point here. King is a bit slower, but... Could crouch. He saw it. Here we go. That's Giant a wall. Swing. Cesaro swing. King of swing. Boom. And the, the wall. wall is there, so no taking out. Taking the full damage from that giant swing. John Man, my brain hurts now just thinking about yeah, okay, the, the downfall go, 1 4 from Azur Center jailing. I can't believe I didn't realize that was all this time that it jails. That's it. And this time he does take it, but Azur Center, not a lot of life. Not a lot of, not a lot left in the tank. And there we go. No. The smash comes out. No. How dare you? How dare you challenge my heat burst? Don't you know my name is King? How dare you? Lose it if something like that were to happen in actual wrestling, man. That, that's that's a hype. I'm doing great, Ramos. You came at the right time. We're checking out the, the end of this tournament. Almost at the end. Whoa, he just was that a uh, he went all out crouch or was he looking for a 4 4 2 or something? That was crazy. All right, oh, tries going for the Atlas Hammer, but no dice. I think that was still a punish. Still alive somehow. Oh! oh! Running sit down power bomb into yeah, you know not to challenge it now, buddy. You learned your lesson. It's close. Good block. Oh, close. But 1 0 Kasim. Gossip as he takes it, dancing and swinging. To Gossip, man. Gossip's been on a roll. For sure, for sure. If he can knock that thing and change the stage only, this is it. The John needs to stick around. Of course, he is going straight to the Boz Gauntlet. But those Gosh, Tekken like World Tour this points, coffee. that is what he needs. And he needs to stay in the game to be able to get them. So let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what he has. Like, Big whiff. Strong. Taking that early lead. Center, those down fours really chopping him down to size, unfortunately. And gets Again! Dude! That's, please give me those skills. That's fucking incredible. Has that heat. Sidestepping, styling on him. Punish. Man, the speed is a big factor here between these two characters. Absolutely is. The John definitely can make things work for him when he gets his heat on. No, nice. the RKO Boom. out of nowhere. That nope. was a It's hard to even get up when that happens. And it pays off brilliantly. Followed up with the people's elbow after the bell. Not sportsmanlike, but that's okay. Oh, Neil. What's up, Reno? How you doing? Oh, tries going for the Atlas Hammer. No punish over there, and he capitalizes on it and gets that combo. Yeah, I just meant like in, in the in the images. So in the images is who's who's the one that looks like he hasn't slept in like in like five days? Is that the John or is that Kasim? All right, getting pushed, getting bullied all the way to the other wall, and he's been blocking. That's it. nice. There we go. He actually oh punished. God, unbelievable. Only because the wall was there. That's the only reason that even worked. Look at this. 
Run it in. Arcade. Boom. Okay. Oh, as a basement drop kick. Smash nope. coming out. Not even he that wouldn't have worked anyway. He's not gonna fly for that type of trick. Download complete. Oh, here we go. Hulkamania, oh, baby. Bust that leg. <laughs> Let me tell you something, brother. <laughs> Sidestep by the John, tries to go in for the grapple, doesn't work out. Uh, nice. Ow. Oh, oh what the hell? How did he even know? Nice. What the fuck? The get up four. We'll take him down. Obviously, not a lot of life left. He did wake up, wake up, shining yeah, wizard. Who does that? Oh yeah, <laughs> for sure, man. This is what this guy is. You know, this isn't even his final form, man. Hundred percent. This isn't even his final form. He has mm -hmm. not played his heart mm -hmm. and soul out yet, and that is something to witness. Kip up, does some damage. Nice. He blocks by both guys, but lands there. Does Gossin. Nice. Standing too. Very good stuff. The wall is right over there. Unfortunately, drops it because oh, of Give me your leg. leg Guess right. Ooh. Or else. Oh, Chain this is going to hurt. He gets good Oki after shooter. this, too. Hmm. Bester is Bester all Bester go, Oki. Smashes him, but block. Time to gas, genius. Oh. No, no. He baited. Interesting timing on the he loves doing that bait. The hop kick, and there we go. Style. I get why that works too, because to a good player, you see a power crush animation, you see him run at you, and in your mind, you're like, okay, whatever he does, I just rage out and it's gonna hit him, and he's fucked, right? But no, actually, you're the one that gets fucked if you rage out. Don't do it. It's a bait. In the second, this third one is gonna be really interesting. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, these Ashes boys, they're cut from a different cloth, and they're showing it to us right now. Back to the same stage, even though we picked random select. And man. This could be John's game to take, but Kossim, gotta watch out because now it's his life on the line. He'll do that at you from full screen. That's how much he knows that it works. Like, he'll test the reaction. Like, I'm just gonna run at you. Don't you wanna rage charge? I'm running at you. And don't rage charge if he does it. He ran in, cancels it. Wow. Holy crap. Perfect. Perfect. Muy perfecto, my friend. Beautiful. The orphans are happy. Maybe. <laughs> There's a reference. Was that a thing? He couldn't block before during that move? I didn't even know that was a thing. I'm just I'm too used to how it is now. Oh here we go. Once again, F five. That throw's so sick. Oh, tries going for the the favorite of every Pakistani, the windmill kick. Sidestep three plus four. That's it goes to show you that I don't know shit about about some wrestlers' moves. That's supposed to be the F five, is that what that move's supposed to be? I definitely don't see that guy fight enough. Showing a lot of patience, a lot of life lead, and there we go. She she tries to jab him out of it. Tries going for the mix up. Eat fast, burning out. Now what's the mix? It's gonna be the RKO, baby. Seals the deal. Two rounds. You're supposed to be. They they say this is what the good players tell me, chat. Supposedly you're supposed to be able to see his hands for the high, and then if you don't see the hands, you're supposed to keep stand blocking. That's what, what they tell me. It ain't easy to do in practice. Oh, a break. Nice break. Oh, I guarantee. Pedigree, baby. Boom. RKO, why'd you get up? You better guess right. Heat smash. Damn, he's dying. Chicken nuggets. Oh, my God. This is intense. This is intense. Oh, oh, no. oh, oh. did they commit? No. Then what the fuck? Oh, oh that was sick. <laughs> he's dead. He's dead. What kind of? Why the fuck was it off axis? What the hell was that? What's wrong with this patch? For why was this off axis? What did he do? Oh my goodness! What the fuck? They broke the mics. That's how hyped that was. The mics broke. That was crazy. John! That was insane. I guess. But they like sidestepped into the wall. That's crazy. None of that makes any sense. Basically. Basically, that's what happened. Guys, that's nutty. He sidestepped enough to sidestep a rage art? That's hard. Rage arts are pretty wild. He broke the game. To go to Yakushima. <laughs> All right, next match. Oh! Usama versus this. This Jun is sick. So in the chat earlier was was mentioned they were like there's a really good Jun Kazama during this, and now I see what they were talking about. It's this homie Usama. 
when people used to play Dragon Ball Fighters, yeah. right? So they had a character called Snell. Demon Slay. Hmm, the way she does it. It's like she's giving, she's giving you the finger. But instead of the finger, she's giving you. <laughs> she's giving you the whole arm. Every single time they be going, I, I, I know they even did like a character select just to get the oh, like or something because <laughs> somebody skipped past it. Oh, just like that. While we're talking, Osama yep. Bossy takes the first game and they had to Very they had to team kill. That's how good they were doing. They were doing so great that now in top five they have to fight each other. But that's good. If you say that you did so good that the two of you have to fight in top five, that means you kicked a lot of ass that day. This was a hard tournament. Six stuff. How is that real? One of the great weaknesses of Feng is that, you know, if you step He's linear. See, I told you earlier, Chai was saying the same thing. He's linear as fuck. I'm telling y'all, Chai. I'm not lying to y'all. It's the truth. Osama's Jun is just so good. A lot to study here. Look at that. Again, oh, that. Do that son. You don't want to do that. That is, that is totally unsafe. He knows exactly where to be, and he knows exactly where not to be. But Ishar have no slouch, obviously, of his own. Beautiful 13 frame punish. Oh, a nice, nice work by Ishar. Just taking him to town on that. That was just godlike him pull. And there it is. A -A. Damn, A -A. double just frame in the same combo? Stalin, like crazy. That was a stylish finish. Double just frame. So Ishar gets himself on the board. Yeah, finally gets around in, but. Sama still very much there. Oh, Sabaki, he didn't fall for it. That was dangerous. I might, I probably would have dropped there, and then I would have died. That looked like a spot that it was okay to drop. Sama, Bossy has something to say about that. No back camp post for you. Three plus four coming out. Oh, Guaranteed mix. Yep. Not gonna be pretty. Bang Damn. Damn. No, he dropped it. He dropped it. Nice. It's still comboed from that far. What the hell? Nicely done. Oh, no, he wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. Damn. I can't believe. Can I go back again? That's how you know these matches are getting crazy. Where even I feel like I just start going back. How how far away did that heat smash combo? What the fuck? That range is crazy. Oh my goodness, that is not gonna be pretty. Holy shit. I mean, I don't know if I can say it's the best period when Jax exists, but I could say that it's really good. Nicely done. If you ask me which one's the best, oh, it's Jack oh, by a mile. It does the, the same damage as everybody else's he smashed on his 10 frames. That's nuts. And it's safe. Why is that move real? That was, that was critical as well. I mean, very low. Health that move could stand to be 12 frames, back. and it still would be the best he smashed in the whole game. Why is it 10 frames? Throw. They didn't even need to use the rage. Beautiful, beautiful stuff by Osama Basi. Ishari is still very much in it, though. Definitely. But it's got to be curtains for one of these. Yeah, guys. Kings is also really good. And we'll have to see who it is because a shot up right now is going to be locked into the Feng. He cannot switch out to the Alyssa even if he wanted to. Yeah, he gets it after guard break too. That's crazy. I know it's a scale combo because the guard break combo still. He gets guard break. He smash. Oh, I, I broke the balcony. Tornado. Combo ender. Wow. Fell for the Kazama Classic, baby. You weren't watching your toes. Never fall for the Kazama Classic. Already in 10 seconds already. Oh, that's one of the first moves that Kazama players press. The the 4-4 four, four lows. Uh-oh. He's coming back. Damn, sick combo. In the corner, he still got all that damage. That would nice duck, dude. How were they so... Bro, these guys are monsters. You can't get away with anything, ever. No matter how scared you got them. You, if you think it's just going to get away with this on, don't, don't think that. You're not getting away with anything. By the boys at Ashes. And there we go, Watt Standing 3 comes out. Launches them up into the air. It's that wasn't even Watt Standing 3. What was that move? That was like Watt Standing 3 plus 4 or something? Because Watt Standing 3 is the 14 frame, the hop kick or move. He dropped the combo. That would have killed, I think. One chance. He was dead, now he's alive. So, oh, great, great throw. Trolls of Sama have been here for him today. Yeah. Mix. No, no mix. No mix for you, buddy. Sama Basi about to call it a day, huh? Of course he is, and a shot up on the verge of elimination. He has to watch out. Back turned two. Put him into activation. Can cans. Got him for whatever he tried to do. I don't even know if that was a counter hit or not. I just know it worked. Sama, dude, he this guy, this guy's being like a combo artist right now. Literally. Oh my God, still going. Throw block though. Good shoulder. 
Damn, that was an all in shoulder, but he got it. No way, dude. He's almost dead. This is disaster. This is disaster. And the down four takes it down. A shot up. Unfortunately, goes out, I believe, in uh, fifth place. Did I watch the mid best event? Uh, I think. No, I didn't watch the end. The team tournament? Was it good? I might have to save it for tomorrow. That might be a good one to watch. The shoulder is really bad. It's either 14 or 15. I'm trying to remember whose is different. One between between Paul and Feng, one guy's is only 14 now. I think they changed it or something like that. One guy's is 15. Or am I wrong? Are they both 15? To the winners final. That's right. Two guys who've been absolutely unblemished so far. I start getting mixed up. I need to test that stuff. It's really bad on block though. You're thinking right in that. If you block a shoulder, yes, you can fuck them up. You're definitely thinking right that way. These guys are guaranteed third place spots, but we'll have to see which one of them actually takes the gauntlet over here. At this event, not the actual gauntlet. Oh, the VTuber buff for Kaiser? Okay, cool. Well, remind me about it, you say, and I'll, I'll check it out because I'm curious why not. I missed it anyway, so. I want to focus on playing some of my Eddie some tomorrow and see how I do in the tap and never sleeps. I don't expect to do that great because I I think most people will be adjusted to Eddie by now. It turned out that Eddie was really popular online. I didn't realize he was so popular, but 7% of the meta. The two weeks that Eddie came out, 7% of the, the meta was Eddie. Thank you so much for joining us. Do subscribe to Boz, support Boz in all of our endeavors. Whether it's people learning him or just people that are converting from their character to him or whatever else it is. going to be in Lahore, May 10th to 12th. If you aren't, make your bookings and travel arrangements round. You don't, right now, you don't want to miss the most legendary Tekken tournament in Pakistan's history. Lee's coming down, Lohai is coming down. Two days of but Zine? Whoa, old school matchup. Holy crap. This is the top three? The winners find no way. Okay, oh, dog. I'm about to say. No fucking way. Kazuya versus Steve, winners final? That would be fucking nuts. Be like, what Tekken is this? What exactly is? It's definitely not Tekken 8. Victor, that's a Tekken 8 character. Now we're talking. The character with the crazy sword that teleports away and chops you in half for too much damage. This is a Tekken 8 character. Now I feel comfortable. We're in the right place. Final of the Pavic 3 tournament on your screens right now. Championship Sunday underway. Running two. Plus frames and counter starter because he needs that. Remember how I was complaining before about Jinpachi? Because Jinpachi had the, the full crowd to mid. That was safe, and then a counter hit starter. Yeah, we're way, we're way past. The arms race is way beyond that shit, bro. The Mishima Zaibatsu has spent billions since then, and new technology has been created. Try blocking all this bullshit. Counter. He is going to make Brazil regret getting that perfect and not letting him get four. I'm excited. I want to have one more smoke after we watch this one. To set me up for the end. Very tempting for both of them. That slip was brilliant, by the way. In the middle of that three punch combo, slip to the right, threw two more, dodged that break. Frazine was trying to get very counter. Done. Now he ran right into it. Very good, stuff. good setup. I like what he did there with the perfumer one plus two. He was trying to establish the plus, but then he got a free OTG, which is even nicer. The highest damage starter that he could get. He could have made it do more damage than this even. He actually wasted the damage a little bit. There we go. Up against the wall. Perzine just relentless. No man Chaudhry, though. Bouncing back. He'd engaged. Bit premature. No problem. Oh, nice. Counter hook. He might pay for that. He's getting a lot of life back, too. He could have made that, that combo hurt much more than he did. As soon as he did down four three four, he ruined the entire combo. Putting the pressure on Fifteen seconds left on the clock. Fazin needs to make some magic happen right now. Twelve seconds. It's gonna be very difficult for him to go. I think I think he has. He definitely has to lead now. Bad rage draw. Why would you do that? Wow. These guys think they're rage draw geniuses. They're rage draw scrubs. They need to stop. The better you are, the worse you are using rage draw. That's a tech and lesson I'm gonna teach y'all right now. The better you are at this game, the worse you are using rage draws. Straight up. Though, I mean, still a lot you start being oh. too smart. Well, they're gonna master jab here because I would master jab Rachar. Oh no, they didn't press. That is a final. God knows where. <laughs> God mm. knows where. Final floor break of this stage. Hey. Hey. All right. All the way. Quick question. Best Steve Fox in the world? Well, minus 19. Okay. Extra bad then. Absolutely. 
you you oh, definitely can launch. Pakistan as of this moment. Oh, yeah, you can definitely see that. Maybe is Paul's only minus fourteen now? No way, that would be too good. They wouldn't give Paul twelve frames total. That's minus fourteen, would they? So close this match. Both guys I say that with a question mark because it's this game. This game is nuts. Okay, minus sixteen. Okay. I was like, they wouldn't do that, would they? I was confused for a second, though. I was like, I had to make sure in my mind. <laughs> oh, shit. I still kind of like Paul in this game. I'm not saying that he's, he's you know, I've said before, I've been making these jokes about this game being like an arms race of just who has the strongest tech or whatever, but the strongest offensive tech. The defensive tech is hard to do anything defensive. Outside of having good sized up game, it's hard to do anything spectacular defensively in this game. It's easier to do something spectacular offensively. The game just lets you do that. Nice slow pound. For sure, for sure. And man, what a match that the was. The 4 2 would have gotten the wall, but I'm not sure if he would have gotten a combo in here. For that to happen. And looks like he will be getting back for that. Closer and closer to that. Oh, man, he didn't even mean for that to work, but it worked out good. That's one thing that's nice about the ducking. You don't realize it at first, but you know when he's in ducking, he's also going under eyes, right? So he could use that sometimes as a read on your jobs when you're coming in. On Victor is really good too because one other thing he comes in when he doesn't come with the jabs he comes in with the back one plus two power crush and that's a high also nice crouch. Damn, I think he's done. And we're seeing that right now. And when he and when he bleeds, he does not enjoy it. He makes sure you don't enjoy it. Cool combo. Rage art. Will it kill? I don't think so. Nope. That's a magic pixel over there. All that white life gone. This scary, yeah. There we are. Back to the one against Steve is, is scary because one of the best ways to get away from him is just the back dash, right? But then up close, even without his tracking moves, he's pretty good at just his frames are good enough that if you try to sidestep, sometimes it won't work. It's hard to step him up close. And then if you step at the wrong time up close and he does back one, then it ends badly for you. He's scaling his combos a lot. Oh, At least he's hitting his combos though. He's hitting them, but he could be juicing those combos, some of them, for like probably like five oh, more damage man. each or something. Three to five damage, head, maybe. Look at that. Ow, Look back at that. one plus two got him. Right in the eye. Whatever offense no had. And now for Zine. He might be nervous because earlier in the tournament when he was loose, he wasn't Blueberry using down for a three four in combos like that. That wasn't even the right combo for the stage. He should be doing a small combo, so then that goes straight to down four four two. Has a lot of ground to cover if he wants to be able to bring this back and stay in a commanding lead. Verzine's probably got his number, so he has to watch out. Has to be patient. Bang. Nice. Wow, wow. Ouch! Oh, That's a wall. Oh. Sick Sorry, combo. Kyle Fields in the chat. What were you saying about Verzine looking human for the first time mm. in this tournament? He, I mean, they're not wrong. If their child was saying he was looking human, he was looking a little bit human during that game, but he brought it back. As he three O's Roman Chaudhry and puts himself on the board one to one in the winner's final. That was nuts. That was nuts. That was crazy for Zine bouncing back, gets a 3 0, took that loss like Michael Jordan took it personal. Now he's going to try to get into this third round. Winner's final. One guy's boxing with his fist, the other guy has a gun and a sword. How is this a fair for who booked this fight? How is this fair? He has knives, a sword, and a gun. The other guy has only his fist. Who the fuck booked this? We still have a ways to go. Look at that. All right. Minus four. Verzine gets him in rage. Getting danger. Oh my god, he almost died to force that trade. Talk about talk about seeing it with your chest. He was betting his life on that trade. Oh, goes for the Mike Tyson. Oh, Rage Art. Oh, I hate Rage Art. Just remove the shit from the game. You know, it doesn't matter who does it or how smart of a Rage Art they do, just take it out of the game. As you see it. That was a raw rage arc, so you don't Oh, instead of down four, three, four. So on the small stage, David E, his best bet would have been just to go straight to down four, four, two, right? And then even though he's tornadoing earlier with the two, 
he could do like his 4-3-2 or whatever it is, and then he would get the 1, be able to get a full wall combo and have a skill less. He's doing so many hits in the combo with the knife extensions from Perfumer that he's adding a lot to the scaling early when he could be saving that for the end at the wall when he wants it. That was an excellent exchange, man. Sometimes saving a little bit of scaling for that last wall hit is worth doing a uh, combo with less hits, things like that. No, you do not mess with oh, him. nice. Belly to belly suplex from the boxer. Gets the Manchon for your arm back. There we are, one round apiece. One game apiece. And these guys are out for blood. He's using his tracking and he's using his his safe mids. So he's making it hard for Numan. He's not leaving anything on the table that Numan can punish easily. So it's like a different style of Victor. This is a good way to fight Steve. If you do a bunch of punishable stuff, then you make his, his life easier. But then if you do stuff that's safe or that he has to crowd or force his way through it, then it's trickier. He has to be active. Let's go. All right. Man, this is make or break. For Zine, seems to what Farzine's doing right now is why typically someone will say Steve is bad. Because they'll play a Steve and then they'll come across a player that's smart like this. And they'll, you know, they'll play nothing but save. And then that forces you as a Steve. You gotta create opportunities like he's doing here. And you gotta block strings that are hard to block and things like that. But Numan's doing it. Final round. Nobody broke the floor yet. Oh, look at that. Just For Victor Dog for 1 no, plus 2 command grab is really valuable right now. But that also makes it predictable. Counter hit back 1. That was godlike. Amazing timing. Spring. But it worked. That's crazy. I can't believe that worked. Swords, knives, guns, you name it. He's a walking weapon. Plus 1. More or less the same health bar. Running to work. Downstairs? No. He didn't take it. And he got a whack combo. That wasn't bad for Numan. He ate a low. Oh, Look he's dead. That of course. That defense. See, that's what I mean about saving the heat smash for when they don't expect it. Because you do so many other things in heat that find that, like, all right, he's not going to heat smash. That shit sucks. And that's the time that they heat smash. It's three out of five, so it's not over. Okay, this is shaping up to be quite the winner's final, man. And Noman Chaudhry. They had a system at one point. Okay, just be happy we got what we got. At one point, you were supposed to be able to activate heat multiple times per round or something. Remember that? Thank God we never got that version. Oh my god. They never gave us that Tekken. All right. Wall not there. So you want to know more about punishing Reyna? Sure, I'll make something if you want, little Yak. I'll try too soon. You can also check out, you know who made a really good video when the game first came out? I think it's Anakin. If you check out his video, it's going to tell you at least how to punish some of the basics. But if you really want me to make something like that, I will consider. I haven't made a tutorial in a while. The last one I did was the, the punishment video. That wasn't even a tutorial. That was me just talking about what I thought about the characters. Now out of heat. Tries going for the back ones, man. Peekaboo stance. Look at that. He's just, he's just, he's just. You don't got nothing to worry about. You say star. Even if I tell people how to beat your character, they're still not gonna do it most of the time. There it is. Okay, that counter will be doing it for him. First round goes to proceed. That four, that four, four, two ain't gonna stop being good anytime soon. You say star. I don't think you got anything to worry about. That many back ones with in my life. Oh, that's a low there. Especially from the Manchon, the guy who is a master. Oh, nice. Hey. Hey. Bon appetit, my friend. He's here to eat. Look at that. Bang. Yeah, he's, he's eating good, man. He's eating good. Oh. Trust a Frenchman to be eating good. Running two. Snails and all that. All right. Uh, too slow. One, not getting there. It's hard to to, to whip punish with 15 on like a grab or something. You gotta really do it quick. Damn, he died for that. That's crazy. If he had done while standing four instead, he might have won. That's close. That is definitely gonna kill. And Rapukin. That's a, a hard skill. Is number one punishing with the correct thing every time when you block lows, and number two trying to default to the smallest punish when you're not sure. Even if it means that you miss out on damage. So like if you always try to launch punish because you think it's a launch low, but then it's not launchable, you miss out. But then if you wild standing four punish a launch low, yes that's bad. But at least you blocked it, you punished it, you put yourself in plus frames. Versus if you did the wrong punish, you'd be in a worse position. not let him go. Gets the grab. Belly to belly, side. bro, in it. Look at that. Boom. Nice. Right. He was ready. Good break. He would have died. That was a clutch break. 
No counter. Steve, look at this. Damn. Bang. Oh, he's alive. Oh, he got through it. Oh, beautiful. no way. That an auto side step that? That's crazy. I think he did the same thing again. The side. Who? I'm surprised I didn't beat down 4 1. Okay. Ah, there we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Counter. Counter hit coming out. Man. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah. Africa. Wow. Look at that. Okay. Dashing in. Expulsion. Right now, wants to be able to capitalize that this is his game to take, man. It is 2 1. Oh. He's just running at him. Do something about it. Do something, Farzee. Not safe. It looks like he is. Oh, on the third team. Getting closer and closer. Good block. Oh my god. He, he, maybe he can kill Rage Art? Wow. He, he should have done that because he gave away his plan that he likes doing at the previous round. The previous round, in a similar almost had him dead situation, he tried to go for running slot and it got sidestepped. Remember? Sometimes you got to be careful about don't go for the same plan twice. If it didn't work the first time, just put it back in your pocket. Oh my god, the duck on the back one plus two during hit stop. He's doing everything right. That first scene is sitting on right now. Activation, the one shoulder. Bang. In a great position to be. Brazine's got to make up for it. He has the heat. But will he be using Sick whip like punish. Anytime soon as he gets pummeled. He's dead, right? And there it is! The one shoulder equalizes it two to two. And Man. takes it down to the final God damn. game. I could never imagine what playing Steve like final. this. What a winner's final. But no one shot, he bounced back. Spectacular. This shit is crazy to even watch. Brilliant stuff by him. We are going to go to the final. Die breaker. Captain Silver. Give me the water. Yeah. <laughs> the cup's so new it still has the tag on it. They got that from the 7-Eleven down the block. How tough this is to commentate. They're like, hey, we need some cups, man. We're about to do a tournament. They're like, no problem. I got you. How many you need? Of our lives, ladies and gentlemen. The chips are down. It's game five. At least they're not the red solo cups. As we get into it now, Steve burning up that heat. And... Victor content with just hanging back, making sure that he loses it. He doesn't have to deal with it. Activation coming out from Farzine. The back one plus two looks really annoying for Steve to deal with. Oh. I see that's why Numan is doing he's he's on point with stuff like like the hit stop into ducking under it and other tricks. Because it doesn't look like an easy move for him to stop. For sure. One over for Farzine so far. Numan Chodri going for that belly to belly again. Does not work. Nice. Very cute stuff. Gets the tail spin early, so not a lot to do, but the wall's already there. Well, the, the, the guy that's playing him, this guy is like one of the top Pakistan players, period, Farzine. Putting out a textbook on how to play he's, he's well known oh. even at, during the second seven era when people were getting big about Arsene. He was oh, he well known even during the, the second half of that era. Honestly, both these players are kind of well known for how good they are in Pakistan. It's not a surprise that they're in top three. If this is winner's final, you can't imagine what grand finals is going to be like, man. All right. Farzeen backing off. Wants to be able to stay in a comfortable position. He does not have the life lead right now. But which God means he damn. will have to go in. And no He's going to keep the lead, isn't he? Him. One plus two. No I counter hit, though. Oh, oh, fuck. Back back it went under his jab. What the hell? Again, on match point. Grand what a privilege move. Point. And I play this character. I, I can't defend that, though. How privilege is the running two that it went under a jab like that? Even though he had Good block. That's a punish. One of the few things on earth that poor Steve can launch. That's a wall. Almost. Hey, but now he's there. And he's going to make something. He should have he shouldn't have hit that. He should just let the Sonic Fang hit. Oh, my goodness. Counter hit coming out. He might have got a wall spot. Not a move that you want hit. Uh oh. oh he's in trouble. Look at that. It's free mix. Get off. Good duck. He check ducked it. Oh my god. Damn, dude. Surviving. This guy doesn't die. His fastest launch? I don't know. He's really slow. Crouching, he doesn't launch until like 17 frames or 18 frames. And then standing, when can he launch standing? 22? When, when does Steve launch standing? He, he does not have like much of a standing launch. Just forget about that shit. Oh, so Guard break. 
takes the guard but doesn't get anything out of it. Brzeen has to activate to be able to get the pressure off of him. No monstering everything but the kitchen sink. Basically, Mike forget about that shit. Steve doesn't launch he anything. He is the kitchen sink. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Brzeen in a bit of trouble, but he's trying to get that momentum back. Brzeen yeah, back one is his launcher. <laughs> <laughs> Stacking up the white light. Oh, no much oh, get it there. God damn. This guy is fucking incredible. Round. Especially Five as the chat rounds. starts asking me things oh, and y'all start catching on. I'm glad that you guys are asking good questions too. Like, when does Steve launch? He doesn't. This guy does not have launchers. He just has to be better than the other guy. He tried to snake charm him. Oh, no, back one didn't work. In a very good uh -oh. lane, this might actually be the way that he wants it to play, and he goes... No way, dude, again? You can't come back again. No way, dude. No, finally, he ran out of comeback power. His comebacks were too god like that entire set. Fucking legendary Steve, dude. Even though he took the L, that was too fun to watch. Punches his ticket to the grand final. That is our four, do, does he have 16 frame launch now? That's cool. There was a time where standing he couldn't launch until I don't even know. I can't remember if it was 18 frames or 22 frames. I know he has a 22 frame launcher. He has an 18 frame move he can do. I can't even remember if it launches or not. Oh man, does he deserve that spot in the grand final winner's side after what we've just seen? He's not really known for launching. That's not really his thing. Excellent show. My God, ladies and gentlemen, this is Havoc. Tweet All right, guys, I'm going to have one more smoke so we can. Yeah, he has he has the delay hop kick. It's really slow, but he has it. He can do that on certain things. Like, you know, when Devil Jin does his stupid fly gimmicks, you can delay jump hop kick that with Steven. You can kill him for it. So at least you have that. All right, guys, I'm going to let it play, right? And just grab the smoke and come right back here. I'll see you in a second. We want to know in the chat oh, it doesn't launch anymore? The delay jump hop kick? Wow, that's fucked up. Why would you do that to him? So he can do a full delay jump hop kick and it won't launch them if they're grounded? That's fucking nuts. That's so terrible. They hate Steve. I'll be right back. Oh, no, it's going to be actually, I think it's, yeah, it's going to be like... Ashes versus Ashes. Ashes versus Ashes right now. Sorry. My bad, my bad. So this is for fourth place. So we're going to decide now who takes it between the John and Osama Abbasi. Ladies and gentlemen, this is another killer match between a young one and a master of disaster. Oh my God. The young boy versus the biggest Chad I know. Osama versus the John, man. Let's go. T-H-E. John down in the chat, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get it going. Kashmir, stand up. Your boys made it so far, Sama Abbasi. Let's see if you can keep it going. Wow, look at that. All right. And look at that, man. A Jun, Kas a Jun Kazama up in grand up in the loser side over here at top four. And there we go into the wall. Oh, my goodness. That damage. Giant swing. Sar swing. King of swing. Bang. Hey. There we go. Activation coming out for a minute. There we go. Hey, what are you spinning around for, lady? Here, take a power bomb. Jumping power bomb. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful work, man. That's what you love to see. Oh, nice. Counter hit. Obviously. The John does know a lot of the tricks. There we go. Swooped up, unfortunately. And the wall's right over there. High wall splat. Oh, man. Gets up with the spring kick. Look at oh, that. Ho, ho. Sama not letting up whatsoever. The John's still dangerous. You know this. Well, he just runs in. He's taking advantage of the situation. Someone wants to play patiently. All right, you know he's gonna wear out our patience. Activation. Oh, oh shiny wizard, no dice. Hey, finally you saw him press some buttons that actually closes the round out. He's so quick with that jaguar step as well, but did not work from that time. Low for Osama to start. John knows that he needs to be able to put some distance between him. Oh, Sabaki comes out. It's not your turn, it's my turn. It's always my turn, big man. Hey. Damn. Right, I know you from Tekken too. Ah. All right, top four continues, everybody. I'm back with y'all. You guys have seen already a bit of the first game, but it's this amazing Jun Kazama player. Oh, they had like four guys from Ash's team in top five or something, or three guys, huh? Team Ash's ain't fucking around. Is this all Arson Ash's team? Is that what he calls them, Ash's Gaming? Well, they're all nice as hell. They're going to beat everybody. For real. I'm not even joking. I'm saying that. Not just complimenting. I'm saying that, like, for real, they're going to beat everybody. 
And obviously that is unblockable. Oh! Hey. Good read by Osama. Okay. They're so good they start beating they started beating Arson's ass. Oh no, just That's how good they are. Right now everything is working, everything is breaking, everything is working. Oh, Damn, that was a really good rage chart. Beautiful timing. He's gonna go into that torture act, throws him up, grabs him. Need to the midsection. Oh yeah, is that the one that DreamHack is doing qualifier for? Is that what you're talking about? Uh, I don't know what to say. Go. Yeah, final round. <laughs> Apparently, uh, DreamHack is doing qualifiers for some big Riyadh tournament that has a humongous prize pool. I can't even imagine. I kind of want to go to one of them now just for giggles. I don't think I want to qualify, but I want to go just to play against good players. I might check it out. It depends on the st if, if I can make my schedule work. I got some, some flight points saved up. I can definitely get a flight. I probably will have to come out of pocket for the hotel room, but you guys have been giving me subs and stuff. Oh my god, pedigree. Every time I see it, it looks so dope. It looks way cooler than how Triple H does it. Because, you know, when Triple H does the pedigree, of course, he's not trying to kill you in real life, right? He's just trying to do it to entertain the crowd. So he does it, and they do their little gimmicks so that it's kind of safe and it doesn't hurt the other guy, right? But when King does the pedigree, he fucking drops you, bam, straight on your skull. All around great superstars, King. My god, what what a great first match. A million dollars, huh? Damn, who's gonna, whoever whoever wins, if you're listening to the stream, whoever wins a million dollars, don't forget about Team Spooky. Throw me like five subs or something. Five subs won't hurt you. All right, so now we're going to go into the next game. This is obviously Osama Bossy's last life because this is not winner's <laughs> final. This is, winners, this is loser's semi-final. The champion of the orphans versus Mama Kazama once again. Here we go. All right. He's going in. Osama does not... One, one of them, the player, the John, the one on the, 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 the king player, he's traveled, I think, a little bit. I can't remember what he's traveled to. I just remember seeing this guy more than once. This is probably the fourth or the fifth time I've seen him. And he's always been, a, every time I've seen this guy play, guaranteed like top eight. I never see him be a tournament and not be at least top eight every time. Backing off, he knows that this is important for him. And, you know, like, keeping his distance has been working out for him. But the back three going to be disastrous for him. As Osama gains capitalization. And there we go. Scooped up once again. Launched like a ragdoll. And into the sidewall. Into the sidewall once more, and there it doesn't matter. Hey! Nice. Good answer. He bursts the break armor. I say it every time, but this is, you know. Sorry if I. Sorry, sorry to anybody that knows the game and hears me reiterate the same lessons over and over. Y'all might get bored of it after a while, but. Into the mixes. There we go. Oh, the John is being made an example of oh, right now. Oh my goodness. Bossy, relax, man. Oh, he took that. Yeah, oh, put it in the favorites. Ding. <laughs> Add another quarter. Damn, Ding. Man. See, this is why you cannot count the young man out. These young kids, they've been proving themselves time and time again that they are the future. And this is what you see on your screen, ladies and gentlemen. The John being manhandled by Jun Kazama. Yeah, Osama these guys are Omega good. Our final game between these two. One of them is going home, and we'll have to see which one. Man, that is a shame. I'm ready to acknowledge the job. I hope somehow. I don't know how, but I hope that somehow the visas get like easier for them or something. Cause look how long they've been doing this, and they still struggle to travel anywhere. And they're ready to kick everyone's ass. I want to see it. Win or lose, I don't care who wins. I just want to see them have their fair chance to do battle against everybody else. Cause clearly these dudes are nice as fuck. There's no other way to describe their gameplay. Just want to see them have a chance to have a fair fight against everybody else that's nice as fuck. Dead, pedigree baby, right in the skull. Boom! Look at that. Drop the run out of the headband. She got to play the game for sure. <laughs> One of those protective All right. finishes. Yeah, we, we watched that when it happened. Oh, it out of it. No sharpshooters over here. The, uh, the, f the first to ten. What's coming after. Uh -huh. For sure, while standing for. All right, just look at that. Look at the I believe we watched it. That was a while back. Two Jaguar steps back. Good chase. Good, good break. He was ready. Wow, man. You can't get away with that on these guys like you can on Scrubs. Scrubs will never hey, crouch stop. The spring kick not working in his favor, and Osama Bossy equalizes. These guys every time. If it doesn't counter hit, don't don't dare finish that. Even if it normal hits, don't dare finish that. Only counter hit. Collateral damage. Man, you know what? We're seeing we're seeing everyone beat over here. Llamas, leopards. <laughs> that was guaranteed. Called, the animal control or whatever. I don't know. Here we go. There we are. All right. So. 
Solo Bossy and Heat right now. Damn, they're both quick. They're so fast. Is that what they mean about the young man reactions? They're snappy. Every time that there's a whiff, something's in there. Oh, that is crucial. That is massive. Definitely is they the John is one. Yeah, I don't I don't understand. Why are people that had visas having trouble getting visas? That's the part I'm confused about because Arson had a visa already to Japan. He went years ago. They told him, no, you can't have our master's points this time, Arson Ash. You better go to Evo. That's what they told him. This is his chance. Oh, drops it. Suplex regular throw. No, that wasn't even the suplex, that was regular throw. He messed up. Goes for the mid once more or gets blocked again. Does not opt to punish. Oh! Goes for standing wizard. Equalizes it. Now we're going to the final round. Once yeah, I know, again. man. And I, I can't even. Do, I haven't been to Japan in a while. I miss going. But I can't d defend what I see other people do in Japan sometimes. I'm just like, damn, that's how y'all like when y'all on vacation, huh? No way. I just be looking at them like, that's for real how y'all like while y'all on vacation, huh? It just makes it embarrassing for me. I don't even. They probably look at me like, oh, here comes another asshole foreigner. And I just try my best to be polite and follow the rules and have a good time. You know what I mean? Osama! Osama, so smart! Wow! Eliminates the John from the tournament in okay. fourth position. And this young man will be going over to face some of the strongest in the region, man. Top three now. We're almost there, guys. Oh, they're going on break. Well, we're not going on break. I'm just going to stick around with y'all. I breaked enough. Just now I had my, my break. What's up, Frog Blog? Yeah, I'm sorry, Frog Blog. That's why I'm not going back, because I ruined Japan enough time. So I'm not going back. I'm probably not going back to Japan for another couple of years. The way this is going. We are back here at Hair for the Last. Are you feeling right, Dina? For 23 Dragon off how the cookie be seen. And we're about to see how this plays out now. Absolutely. Here we go. All right, let's go. Siege here, lady, the I don't mind. I had, had fun last time I was there. I'm not trying to be like, oh, no, I miss it so bad. I got to go back. Ah. The next time that I go, I'll just make sure to enjoy it fully while I'm there. And that'll probably satisfy me for a while again. I'm not too worried about it. The June for Dragunov, very yeah, interesting. I think, um, you know, at this stage, he probably feels oh. more comfortable going in with this particular matchup. So that's why, you know, he's feeling that... If I can say the, only, if I can say the thing I miss the most is food, then, like, I'm fine. You know what I mean? Like, I'll, I'll live. Right now, here we go, Russian Assault. Break the throw. Yeah, give me my money, bro. Nice, nice, nice. Very good start there for Noman Chaudhry. Nice. Beautiful delay on that while rising to get that throw. One plus two. Here we go. I haven't even been playing Darius like that lately. To be like, well, I'm going to go to Akiba and try to score on the Darius cap. I would need to practice before that. Oh, wow. Slightly late because this particular my god. The burst as well, but Noman Chaudhry got lucky. My Darius practice has been fighting Nerd Josh when Nerd Josh hits me with the Ray Jar and he makes the, the fish into the Darius fish and it flies at me. Here we go. Got away with that death march in the back four three. Yeah, hell yeah. Well, when you do go, man, enjoy it to the fullest, bro. It's a fun place to be. Pardon the confusion with the names. Yeah. Noman Chaudhry playing with Steve. Dragonov or Sama. Yeah, beautiful albatross forcing him towards the corner. Not the red though, both red. Oh, beautiful throw break once again by Numan Chaudhry. Ooh. Nice, that delay on the flicker one down one. Three nothing. Forward one, I beg your pardon. And wow, man, Numan Chaudhry is, you know, okay. This is not surprising, let's be honest, because from the last two tournament that has happened, Noman Chaudhry was in the grand final. And in one particular tournament, he actually won the tournament yeah, yeah. against Berzine. Yeah. Berzine and him are like training partner. As it seems, we are definitely heading towards the same kind of grand final like Berzine and Noman Chaudhry. But I must say that, you know, he's back with the Jun. Yes. You know, it can definitely work out for him because it has worked for him so far so yeah i know dude that steve is freaking amazing crap this guy numan this guy is just beast and here we go a raw upper 
yeah, should I mean... be able to carry its steam every day. <gasps> if no it has it break, if it ain't broke, wow. fix it, right? June's been working for Osama so far, he's gone back to it. I don't even know how to use, like, the way that they use parries like that. Like, I, I sometimes I play characters that have a parry, and I can't even imagine using a parry like that to just stop them from doing a wake-up attack or waking up and pressing a jab. Defense is essential in this game because um, the skin has a certain. I guess you have to do that as a Steve, huh? Just to keep them locked down. That's like it's not. It's not that. Oh my God! Versus Dasabaki is hella easy to use. That's a deadly weapon against Steve. This guy got nothing but punches, and this move destroys punches. Perfecto, almost forgot. Beautiful down there. The start for Osama. Counter hits. Here we go. Kabul one beautiful while rising one two. Bang. Nice poke, but the burst kind of came nice. out and upper for the launch. No sage hazards ooh, here. Ooh, so ooh, ooh, nonetheless, ooh. definitely gonna do the massage. Nice beautiful homing. Burst coming out from Osama. Spends it straight away. Nice poke again. Beautiful oh, duck on Holy yeah. shit, dude. Still got and right just right. just imagine if he played a character that could launch. Just imagine the kind of damage that he could do, but no piece of Steve. Massive. I forgot now. Nice. Starts the heat. You know, he's one of those guys who basically, you know, takes his grind really seriously. Yeah. Like he trains with the likes of Phaeton and Isharib and everyone. So you can clearly see his game. Um, you know, has evolved through throughout the time, and he's having a great time in Tekken 8. Wow, what a beautiful, oh, beautiful sidestep, man. Yeah, brilliant timing. Well, Osama slowly bringing it back. It's most stuffy as the Steve player, and it's it, probably even in his mind, this has got to be one of the most dangerous targets. You got the character with the, the dumb punch, Sabaki. She got the low high hop kick that counter hits his jabs randomly and does too much damage. She got too many good moves against him. Oh, that would have been even broke the wall. Yeah. And then the combo, bro. Sama had a plan. Sama but beautifully done beautiful. there. Man, that is her natural prey. Steve Fox. One one. Brilliantly done. Dies at one to one. I mean, this dude shows you why you should be. He has to do all that just to stop her. Those godlike ducks and everything else that he does. You know. You should definitely, you know, play. Try if he doesn't know, do all those things, he can't win. Get to play with the pros to, you know, get that 2x. Yeah. He has that 2x, bro. I mean, what a win this would be for Game three. Boss if he can go all the way. I right think it's 2 out of 3. It that. should be 2 out of 3. Two oh, slow. they messed up stage again. Nice. Oh, no. It's second World Tour rules, so they have to change stage every time. Even if they, they don't care. And like, we just play again. No, that's not allowed. They have to choose stage again. Burst coming out. Both in heat. Sama is in red as well, but nonetheless. Dead. Damn, I can't believe he made that shitty heat smash work. That's crazy. Here at the Urban Square Lady, that let him go. Sabaki. Beautiful combo. Should be able to take him to the wall. Yes. Bang, bang. Boom. This is this is like a blue deck versus like a green deck or something in Magic the Gathering. The green deck is trying to be all cute and just summon some big creatures or something, and the blue guy just goes counter spell. You're like, what the fuck? So my thing just goes in the graveyard? Yeah. Then I draw three more cards. Oh yeah, what'd you draw? Three more counter spells, asshole. That's the moment that you understand it's a bad matchup. That's like this right now. Wow, my dude is master at using the homing. Yes. Yo, the raise. Don't give me that forward two cancel. Thank you. Bloody much. <laughs> That's the moment you realize something's wrong. When they draw cards, like, what'd you draw? Three more counter spells. You're like, oh fuck. <laughs> Wow, the patience, absolutely. <laughs> you know, having that life lead had given him the ability to just, you know, wait and watch. But here it we go. The throws throw track now. Isn't that weird? Wow. I'm still not used to that either. But oh it's a thing. God, I use it, of course. Wow. Oh Unreal Ray Jar. My God. That was insane. Pulling it out at the back. I've seen this Ray Jar so rarely that I never even noticed. Look at the beginning. It flips them over. I never noticed it does that. Look what it does at the start of the Ray Jar. Oh, oh my god, that could kill I never oh noticed it does god. this. Watch. <laughs> it does. I was never see this move. 
damn, Steve back, barely man. exists. Yeah, absolutely. By yeah. any All right. means necessary. Necessary. <laughs> That's what it oh takes. Oh my god. <laughs> that was such a great preference, though. Okay, great. Bang, bang, boom. And here we oh, go, side nice. step four. Caught him taking this time, plus frame. Osama is cutting loose now. Yeah. Thank you so much for the hug. Not interested. No. Oh my god, dad. Oh. Dad. Damn, kick, kicked him so hard he did a backflip. Down four, four. Right to the gut. Oh, oh, oh. Down forward two, fam. Where you going, man? Brilliant. Elder Frost. Oh, oh my god, this move goes nice. under highs. I think they could have oh, tornadoed. He's ready. He'd activate a block though. Maybe. Once again, try oh, to get in there. Oh, hit. Was that a tornado Holy starter? I'll never remember now. Too late. Oh, another combo. Still got the wall. Sick combo. He stretched it. Very sensible, man. And then he made it too hard to predict what was coming too with the lows at the end. I wish like only you know, quick lows. I was that good. That's how, <laughs> that's how bloody good he is. It's <laughs> yeah, little yak. That would be crazy. Could you imagine? So Steve is so good that Shinblade just wins Evo and beats everybody's ass. That would be nuts. You think that you know someone else is gonna win the tournament and yeah. someone else's favorite? This dude just you know you know just spears the whole the whole world collectively. Dude, the whole the world collectively looks at each other confused. Like, what the hell? Shinblade was that good? Secretly, so Steve was god like y'all all just sucked. Yo, that's that's why you can't be doing that. Doing that. See what I told you about moves what having counters? You can't be just doing it. He did that once. One time. He fucked him up. How dare you? You want high string mix ups? That's not allowed. This is high level. That's crazy. Don't even try that shit on me. Yeah, I know. Exactly. When you see that, that's the time to be like, damn, nice Steve, bro. He'll be like, thanks, man. That's the, that's, that for real is the moment where you're like, nice Steve. A Steve player who knows when to use the Sonic is the best player. 100%. Absolutely. Traditional Steve move. Very nice. Yo, wow, got away with wow. that power crush with that He got, he was excellent duck. Bang. Activate. Yeah, I might check it out and see, see what's up. Oh, oh, what a beautiful break, despite yeah. being... As long as nobody oh, over nice. there gets... The, yeah. Man, I don't really know nobody here. That's the problem. That's part of why I'm scared to watch that tournament. I don't want them to be like, why the fuck is Pinky watching that tournament? We need to get permission to do that. Just long enough. We don't know, bro, like that. Bro, he still got the heat. Oh, oh my God. God. Beautiful. <laughs> grabbing her, grabbing her knee. Oh, my knee. Shenanigans. The old oh, grandma yo, knee. Punish. Yeah, had to punish that. Osama needs this round. What? Man. He yeah, needs three in a row, actually. Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. That, that was crazy. He's, he, is he falling apart? Is that why he did that? Is that is that him falling finally him falling apart? Yo, this guy played so good the whole tournament. I can't believe he just did a, 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 a scrubby ass forward two for no reason like that. Wow, man. It is. I think I think his opponent was confused too. That's why you heard me react like what? Like why would you do that? That was terrible. What? <laughs> that's so bad. That's like I'm not saying that you should never do that, right? But that's that's atypical. Of that player's play style up until that point, it was atypical to do something for that. That was like a desperation move. Maybe he forgot to do the follow up. These two have been grinding like crazy, and yeah. they're very good friends. Yeah. And you're their trading partner. So we saw that in the winner's final. They also. Did he really? You want to see it again? Sure. In the winner's final, we noticed that, you know, like. Yeah, I guess so. He just went for it. That's great. That was, that was crazy. Needs to keep his hand. Tried. And. Damn, you know, he was that he good. To, what a god. So is this loser's final? It is loser's final. This should be another good one. This is the... Oh no, it's Grands. That was loser's finals was the sick Junk Kazama. That Junk Kazama was beast as fuck. For real. I can't believe... I, honestly, I can't believe he won. That's how beast that Junk Kazama was. And that was a matchup that's real, real tricky as a steep player to win that matchup. Pretty sure the others will get the chance if they are already qualified. But here we you go. must despise all humans. They are to be your prey. That's for real. That's that's that matchup typically. Time for talking. Alucard means like what? 
for action and start by slaying that Steve the over there. So this is very, very high stakes. That's for I mean, typically probably what John Kazama would do to Steve players. For a chance to play for one million rupees at HUFC Club from May 10th to May 12th, joining the ranks of me, you, you, low high. Yo, the so many whips. It's crazy. Definitely should be able to, you know, push him towards the corner. Very nice. The cool glass. That move is ridiculous. Chunked. To be changed, <laughs> but since they have a running two, yeah, I'm surprised that the Sonic Fang Heat Dash doesn't give him a. They just don't want to give him a combo for anything. Other characters get cheap ass Heat Dash, all types of bullshit. He gets Heat Dash, Sonic Fang, no combo. You get an OTG, bro. Hold that. They for real, dude. And yet, yet there's a Steve player in top three. So what do I know? Maybe this is how Steve gotta be. I have really no idea. The game, I must call it out. Remember that the characters that are It's just crazy to me, man. I can't look at this Steve toolkit and see him being that amazing. And, this, and yet this uh, guy if you do just I'm mind blown. For real. The TWT finals with a cat because she's she has been designed for this game. And of course it was a counter matchup for not just two, but here we go, counter hit. Virgin finally getting around. God damn, you don't even get a launch from full chop pop kick no more. When, when you told me that, that's crazy. So they didn't even let him have that. You can't get no full jump kick launch. Not in the crazy Tekken. The Tekken where we have plus 17 heat engages. No, you can't have launch from full jump kick. That's not allowed. He's enraged though. I'm liking what I'm seeing. The spacing from Prisine have been really spectacular, but oh, look at be able to get this round. Both guys in heat. Yeah. They have used their heat. Yes, this is for points, Nero. No way. What a move. He gave him the butt of the sword to the forehead. Oh dummy. Going through the final round. Yo, down to engager. What's gonna happen? Running one plus two. Where you go? What the? F what the hell was that? I'm gonna take it. My God, is this is this a task? Just flush this whole patch. Flush this shit. <laughs> no, should be punished. No, doesn't get that punish. Oh. It always tricky to punish this one. But here we go. Should be able to get the carry, bro. Take that. Bang, uh, Masaji. Machine gun. And after Fist. the kill, the we'll get it done for no uh. one, Chaudhry. First round in the books. First yeah, true. The books true. The new patch is tomorrow, game. finally. Hopefully, what things will be better. They reverted some stuff in this patch, too, right? Yeah. I haven't really looked at the notes. We could take a peek, quick peek after this is over since this is the grand finals. Tonight's Monday. Is anything else worth watching tonight? Or is this it? I know the Sweets event is not back yet. I don't think. I think they're not back until next week. There is no freaking shortcut to be on top. It's the grind that matters at the end of the day. Beautiful whiff launch with the down forward two. WNBA drive. I never watched that shit in my entire life. I don't even watch regular NBA. Wow, thank you. Holy crap. Yeah, because he's so sensitive. Fucking Flock said, ask me anything. I'm an alpaca farmer. Oh, snap. All right. These guys are so smart. They are way beyond our heads right now. Whoa. Do people really make, like, I don't know, like, blankets and all that stuff? I guess so. I think I've been to like, is that, am I thinking the right, the witch's market? Or is that somewhere else? I'm already thinking of some, oh my god. I'm already thinking of somewhere else. Oh my god. Whoa. See, if you notice something that is so beautiful and magnificent about Frenzyn is that he is playing on a certain range of C. <laughs> Hell yeah, those are good questions. I see two good questions already in the chat. All right, so here we go. So this is the start of it. Fucking Flock said, um, I'm an alpaca farmer uh, in honor of the stage. And then uh, one question was, how, how, how long does it take for their fur to grow back? That's actually a good question. And then uh, you say Star's question was basically what are the benefits of having alpacas compared to other animals? Both kind of good questions. <laughs> yeah, I mean, understandable. You're two rounds up. You want to get this one out of the way. Get that. Go ham if you like. If not, no big deal. Thanks for the bits either way. It's greatly appreciated. Oh, low there from no Careful. Gets that round. Gets that round. 
Here we go. Beautiful punish. One, one, two. Nice. See that? Like, he knows that he's going to be using... Oh, counter. oh huge counter. Should be Man. Able to get the wall here. Beautiful adjustment. Nice skip up there by first team. Counter right back at you. I love how the questions came. One was from Twitch and one was from YouTube. I love how that turned out. That's pretty funny. Ouch. One one. Give me the water. No Akuma, no problem. I got the new Akuma. And while we know that Numancho three definitely needs to win the set in order to reset the bracket. He's so bananas that when you try to whiff punish him, he teleports away. To, you know, entertain yeah. his plan. Unstoppable except that first match. I mean, Noman able to get the dub. Frizzy able to bounce back in dominant fashion just now. Honestly, they're Let's both locked in. This is pretty amazing. Well, well, match. well, Victor on his home ground here. So... And this stage should be very good for Steve because Steve can carry from any. I don't even know. As someone that, that kind of knows how to fight Steve, I, I never really feel like I struggle against a Steve player with Victor. Usually, if they beat me there, well, I'm just like, wow, good job, you were better. I can even tell as they're playing that they outplayed me. I'm just like, oh, wow, he knew when to step, he knew what to punish, and why. He did everything right. You know, They'll like duck my four four one you know, while standing one two me. I'm like okay, nobody else ducks that. Only a Steve, only a Steve, only a Steve or Akazia ducks there. Oh, Thank you so much. I don't know what just happened. I just heard something. Come on, he's gonna capitalize on that. He's in heat now. As him up against the wall, Frizine stayed down. Oh my God, that was ten subs. Buck and flock. Thank you. My oh, goodness. Holy crap. Oh, the power crush. What a challenge. Well, I'm glad that. that oh, look at the icons going everywhere. I'm glad that you. Nice. Felt the need to support the channel. It's greatly appreciated. Beautiful. No man, Jodry, so calculated. Beautiful break. What I like to do against Steve? Back one a lot. Jab, dash, jab, da dash, jab, back dash. Oh, that was lucky. Dash, jab, back dash. Uh, back one at range. I'm surprised that he doesn't use back one. Actually, Farzi. He uses instead. His his range move is that. The wall standing one, two. I like to do instead of that. I like to do back one a lot. But that's not a thing that he likes. He does the wall standing one, two. That type of thing. So he's playing. See how he's constantly back dashing? He's not really stepping like he would against somebody else. He's just trying to create space. This guy is just so good that he knows how to stop that. He's got like the dumb block strings that you can't back dash. By the way, don't step either. That doesn't work. So she had Farzine instead. See, he has to wait his turn, and then now he can backdash like this. And that's how he, he survives the pressure. Just backdash, backdash, get in, create space, scare them, then backdash. Farzine still in it, still signs of life, still no problem. He's still very much alive in this game. Absolutely. Yo, this whole crowd from Buster, bro, this is twice now, maybe thrice. Look at that. Right now. Space. Oh my god. He did. That was not a worthwhile trade. Oh, the upper. Flurry. He's still got the heat intact, bro. This combo should be ridiculous. Oh, he tried He tried to get a, a, a one of the special, the side spot style combos. He almost had that. No man. Chaudhry just so dominant. Oh. Two games now. This guy's sick. How long have I been playing Tekken? I've been playing Tekken on and off. So serious Tekken where like I like I knew what was going on on and off since like Tekken 5 era. Yeah. Like it's not gonna be oh the My favorite Tekken to play casually before I knew what was going on was that PlayStation 2 version of Tekken Tag Tournament 1. That that version sick. It still holds up to this day. It's a very good game. But I didn't know how to play Tekken back then. I just thought that that game was amazing. I was like, man, these graphics are great. This music is sick. I would just mash buttons against the CPU. Suddenly just back in that demon form. Yeah. This kid is just absolutely. Have I ever tried to play the Bears? No, but uh, one of my training partners, Nerd Josh, he plays Bears, so I train against him a lot. I have some legacy knowledge against the Bears because in Tekken 7 era, there was a time where Rongchu, the Tekken, one of the Tekken World Tour champions, he won with the Bears. He won with Wakuma for real. He beat a double gen in the grand finals, if you can believe it. And it was a legendary double gen, even it was Kudan. It's one of the best in the world. So he really earned that dub. You know, he beat someone that was a world class player. Anyway, for a while after that, there was a lot of Bear players, and they weren't very good, but, you know, they were inspired by the champ, and they were all online. So during that era, I got a lot of good Bear experience. So I kind of already knew how to fight the character. And in this game, 
Dark. It's not like he got some new moves and some new tricks that I had to learn how to beat. But once I learned how to beat his new tricks, like the legacy Nas all applies. Like the G Clef is still bad on block. Down 4 2 1 is still bad on block. Some of the roll moves are terrible too. Like the roll mid, that one's really terrible on block. So that's the main thing about Bears is that. Uh, when they're on their A game, they're still really scary because there are safe things that they can do. But uh, you know, when you when you're guessing right, then it gets scary for them because if you're on point, you can you can hurt them a lot for some of their big guesses. Yo, he was a rare, but unfortunately couldn't really punish it for some strange reason. Rage is there for Noman. We've seen him. Use it's just about knowing too. Like if you don't know how to be honestly, like as a bear scrub. Like, let's say you're a bear that's coming up and you're a noob. If they don't know how G Clef cannon works, that's probably like the best move in the whole game if they don't understand how it works. Man, what is this game? How they do that? Like, I would have pressed button already. Once they understand how it works, then it's not that. It's, it's okay. It's like a decent launcher move. But if they don't know how it works, then slap, slap, slap. They block. They're scared because you're a giant bear. They don't press anything. You back that, and then you just you do it again. Slap, 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 and then eventually they get hit by it. Yeah, and they just don't know what's happening. Absolutely. Match number five, two a piece. This is intense, ladies and gentlemen. Arena stage. What style is? Oh yeah, that's always a good question. It's some weird ninjutsu style. It's supposed to be combining like different ninjutsu styles. That's why he's the master of the ravens. Like there's raven. He's not the master of raven, like master raven, but you know it's him and the raven corpse. They all work together. Will take it convincingly. Let's just find oh. out. Beautiful reaction there. Oh, 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 oh shoot. Well, I don't know. Uh, he, Akuma and Panda are not like they can get in, but they're not really a character that's dedicated to getting in. But I will tell you a secret, okay? That I find a lot of a lot of bear players get this wrong. Let's watch the last game first, and then I'll tell you about that expert. How about that? Okay. I want to nice. know if it's going to be a reset or not. If he resets, then I'll tell it to you during the first game. You know what? Because I need to reset the bracket. Count. There we go. Take that bloody Juggle. job. That was a perfect time to back one. Against the wall. There we go. Look at that damage just on that combo. Heat engage. Hits him. No man, Chaudhry. Bro, is Steve really about to win this tournament? That would be phenomenal. Will he mix up? Can he bring it back? Beautiful activation. He's still oh. oh, slightly couldn't really backdash because of the excess of the wall. Yeah, I guess. No margin for error in that kind of situation. Not safe. He's starting to get risky now, which means that he's feeling comfortable. But he should be careful because he shouldn't try to give Victor like the window to come back. See, that can happen. Bang, bang, bang. Setting this bracket. But here we go, Farzine. Four, four, two. Stop the combo. Delay. Nice. He delayed it for the spin. Ever oh, beautiful. He, burst. he has a chance thanks to the no. He's, he's good. He's good. This will be around oh, for him. Oh, here we go. First All right, round four. The final game by Farzine. While Numan Chaudhry just one round away from resetting the bracket. Can he do it? Give me my money. Yo. Back one plus two. He thought a string was coming. That's why he did. That's like a thing that every victor does. They try to whip punish with that move because if you do a single move, it'll whip punish you. And then if you do a string, it'll armor through the string and it'll still punish you, right? So it kind of covers both situations. Unless okay. Noman has something oh! to say about it. Here we go. Final, <laughs> final round in the grand final. Can the only thing that really stops that is if you do a string that has like a low in it. Let's see, like a 1 3 string that'll break that all up. All the marbles, ladies and gentlemen, uh, all of them. Yeah. Oh. Careful. Both guys in heat. Both guys in heat. Oh. Again, back one plus two. He couldn't duck in time. Here we go. Albatross engager. What's going to happen? Down 2 1 coming out. Looking for the counter hit. He's hungry for it. Good block. He smelled it. He smelled it. Come on, reset, please. Reset. Uh, one more mix. Come on, just guess right. Oh, no way. No way. You kidding me, bro? Oh, no. oh broken. Just get in there. It's smart. Just get in there. Nice, nice block. Oh my God, dude. Just do something. Come on, Numan. No, fucking ready to Parzin. The Victor Army is victorious. Get the winner's final. <laughs> First Pakistani dojo 
is named after Farzeen, ladies and gentlemen, and he enters the boss hey, gauntlet. That was hype. Manchester Fuck, I wanted a reset so bad. That was getting so good, He'll man. He'll be playing low high. He'll be playing the best in the world. He will be taking a spot, rightful spot, with some of the top players around the world. What a performance all tournament long by this young man. Oh, wow. Man, that was I mean, what a great performance. And what a great day it has been. You got a shout out for Noman Chokri, man. Yeah. What a run by this guy, man. Take That's crazy that basically their Everyone big event is only like a Tekken dojo. And all the best players are there all being killers and shit like that. Like, is this once a year, this event? is in the house. Take your seat, bro. Damn, shit was hype. Oh, they did a post interview? Nice. And you know what? Let's see if he said anything. This is the dude that has proven to the world that... Even Dragusina doesn't give you wins. <laughs> so for Zine, man, um, I'm pretty sure like you have been working a lot for this. You have been playing a lot of tournaments locally oh, those as well. Are worn out. And of them. course you've been training with the Ashes boys. You know, I can clearly tell like you've always been in top four. What is the secret behind it, bro? Why are you killing it? Bro, it's, uh, it's all hard work, you know? Yeah. Uh, I had to prove to people that everybody said that you are nothing uh, without a Puma. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so I worked hard and uh, there's a <laughs> now he has big oh, yeah, you know? yeah, And uh, I'm really happy for the win that I wanted. And of course, I am selected for the boss gauntlet yeah, as well. Man, that so was I'm, I'm, I'm really happy. Yeah. So, now, yeah. so for scene, um, thank you, you, Hot Boy Rob. Uh, How you doing, man? You are being carried by Akuma and yeah. everything. So Damn, that was hype. Good did, tournament. Where did that decision I see some questions in the chat. I'm going to try to answer everything. One was uh, the homie that wanted to know more about so Bears, and then one was a gastro question, really right? Like his coolness. Was it Bears or was it something moves, else? And uh, I thought that he has a good mix ups and uh, yeah. uh, good game, so I decided. I, of course. Should have decided. And one person wants to know about it. Uh, should have picked Opie. Yeah. But uh, also yeah. grab the pyramid. That's it. I, but, I worked but hard. But you picked the daddy of all the Opies, <laughs> bro. You know that. I mean, I'm not saying that Victor that is broken. Hard. But I think Victor is versatile. Yeah, yeah. Why? Because he has a better game plan hmm. than rest of these characters. I will still think that Azusena without Oh yeah, thank you no talent for answering that question. I wanted yeah. to also. But Dragonov is it? He's literally being carried by mm. the running two mm. and the smash and that uh, uh CD. Cool. All right, well, it looks like they're just there chilling talking for a little while. All right, so let me answer some questions for you guys and I'm going to decide what to do next. So uh, one was about a good guide for Eddie to start out with, and it can actually make one. So what you do is, here's what you do. Just go here to share some lore. Yeah, you know, well, we uh, let me find always the rivalry, and uh, yeah. we always have matches in the tournament. Yeah. Me, Noman, and Kasim, we always met in the tournaments. Like, yeah. if not in the pools, we met in the top eight yeah. or in the pools. So it's always, you know, it's 50-50 always. Yeah. Uh, she, he, he sorry, he's my one. training partner. Uh, I would just, uh, there's so some other guides you can check out that have more modern team, info. So like maybe check out some of the combo the guides later, but this is a good one for starting out with. And it tells you like his game. mindset, why he's playing yeah, the character too and all that stuff. I must, I mean, I'm pretty sure like you are extremely proud. That then what else? Evil Japan. Yeah, next weekend, Hot Boy Rob. But I might be working. So I don't know if I'm going to get to restream right now, although I want to. If I can restream, I might have to just rewatch it afterwards. Being the youngest, like how I did with this, that might be what I do. You know, you have def you're definitely going to like you know uh, inspire more players. Yeah. Well, what, 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 I forget what the question. Thank you, Buck and Flock, one more time for the ten subs, man. That was freaking yeah. crazy. It's appreciated, and all the bits that you gave me, really kind of you. This victory means. Uh, I feel like I missed a question. Did I miss one? Start of taking it, and we have a lot of tournaments upcoming. Uh, yeah. like the world tour oh, okay yeah oh okay there you go it was about how to get in oh, as panda yeah. all right so this is uh, i find out a lot of scrub pandas for some reason they don't like to use this tactic even though it's really good for some reason all right he has a move i don't know what the input is is it for one plus two or four for one plus two it's the move where he jumps and he headbutts you and then i think you can choose can you choose any hunting stance or does it just always any hunting stance y'all know what i'm talking about it's one of the best spare moves for some reason people People always say hey i'm having trouble getting in 
and they never use this goddamn move, which is the move to get in with. So it's like, you know, if you want to get in, then, uh, for now or for word, thank you. Every time, like every time. Running one plus two, all right. So, you know, if you, if you want to get in more, then you got to use your best move to get in, which is that move, you know, don't get in and then get in with stupid stuff and then run in and just do down four too much for no reason and get snuffed, get in with your best move, which is your running one plus two, you know. Yeah, it's a little bit boring to get in with the same move over and over, but, you know, if that's the, if you want to be the guy that I need to get in there, right, like, it's one of the best moves to get in with, that's what it's for, that, and then there's like the high wing, the dumb high slash. And there's some other quick moves and things like that, but uh, I don't know. I think for the my best advice to you is you should check out. Uh, you should check out. Because I have the two chances, and I think that that's honestly that's one of the best moves, dude. That move's stupid. It's okay. It's not stupid as in like stupid good, like dragon off running two double good, but it's stupid as in like. You know, they have to kind of try to prevent you from doing that too much because every time you do that, if you do it right, it like snuffs their attempts to get in and jab you or like, you know, it pushes you out and then you're like at the perfect range while you're in the hunting stance where like they have to do something to stop you from your next mix up or it just always, if you use it right. any games, not dropping to lose sight at all and you are officially the champion of Havoc. This puts you in a top spot into the Invitational for Boz Gauntlet, yeah. where you will be facing hey. up against me, Rohai, and the best in the world, Arsalan and Atif, and everyone else. I want to go see that tournament, Boz Gauntlet, that should sound sick. The that, All the uh, Korean players are going to be there, Boz Gauntlet, let's fucking uh, go, I'm definitely hyped. Uh, Korea and everyone. And I will try to win that tournament as well. Yeah, I mean, that's that's the get and move. Yeah, or a, a get and move. It's not the only get and move, but it's one of the best moves for getting in. If you want to be a get in guy, you got to use that move. And for some reason, bear players don't use it. I don't know why. Once you understand its power, then you'll realize. You'll be like, oh, I should have been using this. And now my goal is to win that tournament and to prove everyone that I am a really good player. Inshallah, inshallah you will. And, you know, we have full confidence in you, man. Nice. All right, guys. I think you guys get the point. If you want to re review the matches, I'm going to give you the link one more time to the stream, all right? So go here. Uh, is it actually plus running one plus two? I always figured it was like neutral or small minus. I just figured because he's in hunting bear stance. When he's hunting, all right. The way I see it is when he's when he's in hunting bear stance, minus one is really like plus one, right? And I kind of play the frame data like that because uh, he's he's in a forced crouch state. So even even if he does something like let's say you do a ten frame move, it's most of the time it's going to be a high. It's not going to work. He's in honey bear stance. So that means that really your frame data most characters, unless you have a twelve frame mid or something like that, for most characters your frame data doesn't even start until thirteen frames. So even if he's minus one, a lot of stuff that he does can snuff you there. Yeah, I don't know the actual. I'm I'm curious now. So thanks for telling me the input. Let's go take a look real quick. Uh. You gotta try to figure out, the only thing you gotta try to figure out that I don't know about is, I don't know what are the panda specific gimmicks. I know that she has a different gimmick uh, in heat than Kuma does, because you don't have the 13 frame heat smash. Instead, you have a different weird heat smash, and then you have, uh, she has a, a borrowed Jayu move or something, right? This is not what I'm looking for. Where's... Come on, stop messing with me. I just want to find the stupid... No, come on. Where is the running one plus two? I'm looking for forward, forward, forward. One plus two. I just want to see what the, 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 the actual frame data is. I would just... It says, oh, okay, it's slower than I, no, that's 4, 4, 1 plus 2, it's 4, 4, 4, 1 plus 2, okay, so it's about 20 frames, so it's, it's, actually, that's pretty fast for a, a, a slash kick style move, or a slash mid style move, and it's plus 3 on block, that's verified, and then when it hits, it knocks down, it balcony breaks, it's a heat engager, too, oh, that's good, it chips, yeah, this, this move is good, you should be using this more if you're not using it a lot. It does so. It does match chip. It's plus three, uh, and then you can choose whether or not to go into hunting bear. And 
it also it also has some low crush frames too but not early in the animation like really late in the animation it can low crush that's pretty good all right guys let me see if there's uh let me see if there's any other events that we can check out otherwise i think i'm gonna tap out for the day but I want to see because you know how it is. If there's something worth watching, then I will know how to, I want to watch it. You know how I am. I'm a Tekken fiend. I can't help it every day. Tekken 8. Let's see what's happening. If not, then I'm going to raid somebody. I'll find someone good to raid. VDX is on with Matt viewers. Oh, I'm number three out of all the streams. No tournament, money matches, Sour Piggies chilling. I don't think there's a tournament because if there was, it would have more viewers than me having you guys just hanging out. People just playing on ranked and stuff like that. All right, let's. How about this? Let's give Piggy a raid since we were just talking about bears. Why not? They deserve it. You can also check out if you want a chill stream to learn in. There's the VDX stream that one's live right now. He's got a lot of tutorials and stuff on his channel. Before you do that, you can check out my guides too, especially if you're new to tech and you're trying to get better. You're new to this channel. Uh, check out some of my guides as well before you start checking out all those other guides. And you can also check out the Tech and 8 library, which will help you with learning the punishes of your character and your combos and your tools. And if you absolutely don't know where, if you're fumbling around with your character completely, you don't know what's going on, then check out the Tekken library because it's good for you and it's going to help you out. I'm going to go ahead and give the homies a raid. Come back tomorrow. There's a strong chance that I'm going to enter the tap and never sleep with my Eddie tomorrow. So I'll play some practice, play a little bit of rank to warm up and get my bow whipped on rank. And then I'll go get my bow whipped in the tap and never sleep tournament. Then we can watch the end of it together. It's another very good high level tournament. Maybe not as ridiculous as this tournament, which had some of the best legends in the world period for Pakistan. But there are some legendary players that enter this every week. And a lot of them are world class too, just like this one. So I think you guys will enjoy it if you're new here. Uh, you, you two guys, I'm out of here. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you later, YouTube. Have a nice day. Peace out.